Okay, so wonderful. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Tabletop Simulator. We're playing some uh, 40k today on the table board. Uh, let's see. Let me get my buddy in here. Call him on Discord. Get some uh, mood music too going on. Well, good afternoon, ladies, gentlemen, and those undecided. <laughs> Children of all ages, welcome. So yeah, uh, 40k tabletop sim. I'll send you that invite here. I'll just grab red because why not? And... Bro, I have to be blue. I'm the space furries. <laughs> there you go. The Paw Patrol. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, okay. That one's really did good. I, I like that did one. I show you, did I send you the thing? Or... um. It was off a of grim dank, so you probably saw it, but it was a bullet may have your name written on it, but a grenade simply says, to whom it may concern, insert a chaplain in front of artillery, dear grid coordinates, <laughs> ships in orbit committed exterminatus. This is a public service announcement. <laughs> I've seen it, but I love it every single time. It's so good. All right. Uh, can I join your game? Uh, is... It is currently invite only, and I'm trying to find you on Steam. Oh, uh, sorry. I should be there now. There you are. Sorry. Wonderful. I, uh, I went invisible because I am a sneaky boy. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, also, I have no idea how many people are watching this. Understand that I am relatively brand new to 40k, and I will make all the trash meme jokes about every faction. I play space furries, so... Bring it on! Oh yeah. Chat, get your awoos Vikings. ready. Get your awoos ready. <laughs> yeah, so we're still, I mean, I've played this game back and forth and I've played on and off since then, but I honestly really haven't played at all during 8th and only a little bit during 7th. So in terms of rustiness, I am very. Uh, that being said, I mean, I've been watching a bunch of bat reps recently and uh, Things like Tabletop Titans, who are awesome, or the 40k and 40 mid series, which has amazing editing, is really fun to watch oh, as well. It's so good. Yeah. So they're they're all really wonderful people to watch. So at least I know a little bit here. I'm still trying to figure out how to invite you here. Because I can't invite you through Steam, apparently. Uh, invite to watch apparently but well here let me see if i can i cannot join the game because you locked it huh. uh tops in there can invite friends open the invite friends through steam overlay Ah, it says the Steam overlay. Oh, did you already have the map built and everything? Yeah, I do. Oh, thank God. Okay. All right, you know what? I'll just scrap this room. It took like all 30 seconds to make anyway. So let's create another one. Multiplayer. Uh, make it friends only. Great server. All right, you should be able to join me now. Mm. Here we go. Oh, also, yeah. yeah. So all my 40K books showed up Saturday night. Oh, nice. So I've already run the Space Wolves Codex cover to cover twice. So. <laughs> At least you should be familiar with everything. Me here, I'm going to be struggling trying to remember um, what exactly all my stratagems and such are. So I might miss a few here. I spent nine hours yesterday, and I finished building every single model for my start collecting box. Oh, wonderful. Now you just kind of have to paint them, don't you? Yes, so. OK, yeah, yeah, that's not a big deal. I mean, right. I guess it is, but you know, that's, that's it, a start. It, it, well, and the thing is, it's a start because I've only got two Marines, a pack leader, my Wolf Lord, and my Thunder Wolf Cav left. Which sounds like a lot, and it kind of is, but not really. Mm. So, <laughs> all right. All right. Feast your eyes on this. 
What is this? If it ever loads in, chunk. No, you're you're Including you're a space. The TTS battle size panel because I forgot to delete that. No, you're a space for you have to say, oh whoa, what is this? Okay. No. Um. Wonderful. Okay. Oh, you got Bjorn. And these amazing dry knots. Okay. This looks disgusting. Yep. So, um, for those of you following along at home, yes, I know Bjorn the Fellhand is a wolf and dreadnought. We're working with what we got, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and yes, I know our Jack Rockfist is a wolf guard and terminator armor. Once again, working with what we got. Get yeah, on. it's not perfect. Oh, well. It um, tries. It tries. So, I, I have um, Bjorn the Fellhand as my warlord. Oh, well, I guess I should wait until you're ready, unless we want to start doing an army rundown. Um, I'm going to start lowering the quality just a little bit, because I think this is actually, for some Got reason, them. capping out my CPU. Which Break is the surprising. stream! Yeah, exactly. It's been a little bit of laggy frames, but I think I'd just fix it if I put, turned it down to medium. Okay. Yeah, all right. Now they have a chance. Go on over with what you have. So, I have my warlord... You love him. You know him, Bjorn the Fellhanded, uh, also known as the last surviving member of the original company of Russ, uh, as my warlord. All he, right. He's scary. <laughs> um, good luck killing him. Uh, backed yeah, up that. by our Jack Rockfist, hammer and shield of Logan Grimnar, Wolf King. Um, their support. Two units of Blood Claws with a Blood Claw pack leader. Oh, one yeah. unit of Grey Hunters with a Grey Hunter pack leader. Uh, we have a Venerable Dread with a Hellfrost Cannon and a Great Wolf Claw. Oh. We have a Venerable Dread with the Fenrisian Great Axe and Blizzard Shield. Because <laughs> fuck you, that's why. <laughs> oh, it's disgusting. And then, uh, and Razorback with uh, Storm Bolter and Twin Heavy Bolters because I figured my blood claws are kind of puny and I should put them in something to rumble down the field. So. <laughs> uh, love it, love it. Yeah, so uh, going on over to my guys over here on the other side of the board. Oh god, uh, it takes so long to move. Spin them on over. For some reason I couldn't find the Intercessors in the Imperial Fist uh, colors. Uh, hold on, let me try to turn down the quality a little bit more. Uh, it's still getting a little bit of, like, preset. Low. It's not like we need a ton of polygons for this anyway. I mean, no, we're going to be looking at this from a 30,000 foot view anyway. It's wargaming. So. Yeah. So, all right, let's start over here. This is uh, my big boy my baddie my warlord it's you know him you love him he's a uh, captain lysander right here so yeah he's the shield and thunder hammer guy once again work with what we got without the helmet um all the other non-important terminators with the thunder hammer shield will have a helmet on backing him up we have uh, so yeah like captain lysander here is the warlord um given i don't think anything too fancy uh, so yeah, Chaplain Terminator armor also no, back. Nothing too fancy, he says, with the fucking fist of Dorn. <laughs> Just fucking strength ten, AP minus three, D. No, nothing fancy. Dumpster. <laughs> I, buddy, I. <laughs> Sorry. Keep uh, we we got the Chaplain Terminator armor. He's backing us up. He's buffing our boys here. Uh, he also has the Canticles of Hate and the Mantra of Stink. That uh, Mantra of Strength. That's because I paid for the Master of Sanctity here. Uh, so it has an extra... This guy has an extra uh, litany, I believe is what they're called. So yep. with them, their Doom Squad of two Lightning Claws and three Hammers and Shields. Also, I probably could have done another Claw instead of a Shield, but it's fine. Our Long Range Firepower here on the right, our Predator Annihilator. With Hunter Killer Missile, Storm Bolter, and then four Laz Cannons. It's uh, That's scary. It's got a lot of anti-tank firepower. All right, looking at our infantry here, we got two tactical squads that are identical. Uh, yeah, they're identical. <laughs> I thought I might have given one one more guy, but no, they're the same. So the sergeant on them has a storm bolter and the uh, heavy bolter as well for a heavy weapon on these squads, making the use of that imperial fist 
uh, bolter trail doctrine that they have. Exploding sixes. Re. <laughs> re. Just re. Um, let me pull up my PDF, make sure I'm not missing anything. Yeah, and then finally we have a few intercessors in the back with the auto boat rifles. Uh, I believe there's an auxiliary grenade launcher, which I'm surprised it isn't showing up. I thought that should show up here. Let me double check. I paid for it. Yeah, I got a sorry grenade launcher. So yeah, I was just gonna say I thought I saw it somewhere because that's on your intercessors. Yeah, it's on the intercessors. It's on the list. Um, I will have to play it by ear, I suppose. Here, it's you have it. It's just not showing up. So if we just have to reference it and roll it, we can. Yeah. Okay. Ain't worried. Yeah. Ain't gonna matter. We go get in the melee and your grenades ain't gonna do shit anyway. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so that's it for me. 1,000 points on each side. I'm really curious how this is gonna go, because we both have pretty heavy hitters for melee. So we're both gonna have a bit of a mosh pit, is what I'm assuming. For those who are curious, I am going to get dumpstered. <laughs> I don't know about that. Your dreadnoughts, your Bjorn, your Arjack Rockfist. They might do a really good job against uh, countering my guys, especially the uh, Venerable Dreadnought. I'm kind of I... curious looking at your guys. You don't really have any long-range firepower like I thought you would, though. The only thing you really got is that Hellfrost Cannon. Bruh. Bruh. Uh, am I missing something? Space Wolves. <laughs> what part of advance towards me brethren i am not afeard was unclear <laughs> <laughs> ranged weapons with them in those stinking ranged weapons <laughs> uh, Chat, does this mean i will get dumpstered yes do i care no uh, maybe not i don't know i'm still a scared of all those dreadnoughts gonna be running for me and wrecking shit in combat i i kind of forgot there's three of them yeah I'm there's three of them in, in our deck so here's the beautiful. There's three of them. Two of them have invulnerables, and all of them have a six up feel no pain. Oh really? Oh which one's oh because yeah. of the shield Every one and of them has a six up feel no pain. Okay. Does Bjorn have a what is it, a four up? Bjorn's got a uh I think Bjorn's got a four up and the uh f the uh Fenrisian Axe Blizzard Shield guy has a four up. Okay, yeah, so they're all four oh that makes it even tougher for me to choose targets with that last cannon. And then, um, all, so here's the other great part. All of my Dreadnoughts have Duty Eternal. So, um, every time an attack is allocated to this model, I subtract one from the damage characteristic of that attack to a minimum of one. Oh, yeah, because of the Venerable. Yeah, yeah. No, that's good. S so. That'll soak uh, some wounds for yeah. sure. Yeah. Because all these guys have got eight wounds, which is a plenty of wounds. All right, like, so. It it's not in constant like i'm actually terrified because i've never run anything that i don't want to say tanky but just that tanky before right like <laughs> so the, the thing that chat's missing here is last time i ran what is affectionately known as the wolf pack it was 19 cyber wolves and 15 friend region wolves with canis wolf warrant it was literally it was the wolf pack it was hilarious that was, was a really amazing. funny game yeah, I was playing uh, some Imperial Guard. I managed to bog them down in numbers and shooting uh, with some heavy flamers and sentinels. No, 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 no. You won because of the Volgrins. Don't even get me Okay, that. true. The true. The Volgrins were absolutely <laughs> disgusting that round because he had no AP. I forgot <sighs> about that. Uh, the Volgrins held their own for like four turns. It was disgusting. I was so upset. It was, oh. It was, it got down pretty close. Like, yeah, I think you also had bad luck, too. Honestly, I think that's part of it. Uh, some luck did not go my way. You are, in fact, correct, but that is irrelevant. All right. Um, all right, so uh, what we should do, then, is we should roll off for deployment. Or, actually, we should go over secondary objectives. Uh, what do you have for secondaries? So I have uh, two of them from the standard rules and one of them from the Space Wolves Codex. Okay. So the two that are standard, I I have Slay the Warlord mm -hmm. because why wouldn't I? Oh yeah, um, yeah we're gonna fight each other. <laughs> get shrekt. I have Engage on all fronts <clears throat> okay. because if I'm sitting in my half of the board, I'm losing. 
And then the Space Wolves specific one is called Warrior Pride. Uh, that is three points at the end of the turn if two or more of my units are either in engagement range with an enemy or have charged successfully this turn. Oh, yeah. Okay, you definitely need that too with the heavy melee focus. That, that all sounds yeah. like it plays into your strengths of, yeah, we're just going to get into combat and be, be laying down the pain, essentially. Um, what do you have? Yeah, for mine, I have While We Stand, We Fight, which is I get points for my most expensive units being alive at the end, which would be my Chaplain, uh, Lysander, and my Predator. Um, because if I lose those, I'm probably going to lose anyway. Um, engage on all fronts, similar to you. If I'm not advancing, if I'm not in those fronts with uh, my Terminators trying to bring the fight to you, I'm, I'm going to be in trouble as well here. And finally, raise the banners high because I figure there's some chances for my troops to get into situations where they can just quickly raise the banners on these and uh, and start getting those points. Got it. Yeah. So for this mission, we're doing Eternal War 1, which is Incisive Attack on 286 Vades Worldbook. The primary objective of this is hold 1, hold 2, and hold more. So if you hold... And so if each one of those that you accomplish, you get five points on your uh, command phase every turn. So, yeah. All right, let's roll off for that deployment. All right, and then Ooh, um, I, I got will... A six. I will be... A, you got a six? Oh, boy. Yeet. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, okay, okay. Yes! <laughs> All right, re-roll, re-roll. Another six. <laughs> what? <laughs> you got another one. All right, let's try this again. Ready? Uh, one, two, three. One. Three. Oh, all right. Yes. Okay. What all side right. of the board do you want? And I get to deploy first. Um. Well, I will take blue side because I'm blue and I like things being simple. All right. Fair enough. So, um. Yes. That sounds good to well, me. Mm, uh, whatever you want. Um, yeah, I'll take I'll take blue side. It's not a symmetrical map, so there is potential upsides for each side. Um. But I, mm, mm, actually, you know what? I at fucking hell. Okay. Uh. <sighs> No, I need to take blue side. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay with what my gut told me. Okay. I'm sitting here looking at sight lines, going, "Do I want you to have that much cover?" And then I realized it's not gonna matter after turn <laughs> one anyway, because I'm just gonna be up in your grill, so it's not gonna matter. Yeah, that's true. That's what I'm worried about. There's not quite too much cover on the edge of the map, but in the center of the map is gonna be real hard, and that's probably where you're gonna be advancing too. So that's I have to kind of figure that out here. All right. Um. So I'm gonna deploy. One crew of tactical marines right down the middle. Right down the road. Right down the road. Bye bye. Um, I am okay because I'm a noob. How do transports work? Uh, oh, you do declare if a unit's in a transport right now. Um, but uh, I... basically, you just deploy the transport and the units are in there. Okay, so I am going to put my gray hunters in my razorback okay so my, okay. my gray hunters in my razorback and then i'm gonna get let's get to deploying here sure um ah oh, fuck i have no idea <laughs> um all right chat like i said this is the bit where i just get wrecked um i don't know about that i'm kind of nervous about this game Oh, you're just you're just terrified because I bring a melee heavy army, and that's just a very scary thing most days. Uh, it's uh, a very scary thing because my army is also hinging on a linchpin of melee heavy. It's a Death Star, sure, but if you are if you're able to go through it, I got nothing. Okay, it's kind of I the have, same on both sides, honestly. <laughs> I I'm super excited, so uh, I have deployed my first squad of blood claws. So okay. you're you're go. Wonderful. Um, uh, 
Now I have to figure out how I want to play this. Uh, probably those guys right on the line too. Um. Uh. Let's see. I'll pull these guys back. Whoop, that. Whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah, um. Oh shoot! You know I didn't really look at the specific models. You mind if I move around a little bit on the first deployment? Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, you're good, dude. Don't worry. Like, yeah. I, I just want to move also, those guys. Chat, we're like the laziest SO or we're like the chillest SOBs ever. So uh <laughs> if you came here expecting high level strategic play, <laughs> I'm sorry, is all I'm going to say. <laughs> oh, I love it. Alright, so uh my second is deployed. Oh, uh, see here's here's my problem. Okay, mm -hmm. I've got some blood claws left, and then just an ass ton of vehicles. Oh yeah. Um, light cover obscure. Oh, I have to go around this house. It's not breachable. Seriously. Oh, it isn't. <sighs> what? No, it's got. I feel like it should be breachable. You want to just say it's oh, no, breachable? It's, no, it's light cover. Never mind. Sorry, because it's an obstacle, not a building. Durr. Oh, okay. See previous sentence chat. I'm fucking stupid. Um, okay, Ooh, you get a little. I have no reason. way to get my models in there, but I would like them on the base floor, not the second floor. Okay, sounds good. TTS is just weird like that. So that pretty soon, it's not going to matter after my first movement phase. Uh, there's... but they are on the bottom floor for the purposes of mechanics. Okay, there's got to be a way. I'm that just spins them. Hmm. All right. Well, we can look at that up later. I'm sure there's a way. Uh. I really want to see where you're going to start deploying those big, nasty things, but you're waiting for me to get my guy out there, aren't you? <laughs> Pretty much! Um, how, how does reserves work? Can I just... Do I have to clear each thing as reserves as it comes up? I think that's how it works, but I'm not... For, like, for like the teleport strike or whatever? Yeah. Yeah, and it's a CP per, so... Yeah, well, I've calculated oh, yeah. all the CP. Each of them starts with six. There we go. Okay, um, so I can say it's in reserve, the and then... Hmm? Don't you have an ability at the beginning of the game where you can roll and get more CP? I do, yes. We can yes. do that at the beginning of the game. So, uh, I have assigned us all our uh, command points, so we should be good then. Okay, wonderful. Um, uh, with my teleport strike, I can actually go down to three because I calculated it all. Uh, Lysander is going into reserves. Okay, so who all do you have in reserves? Uh, Lysander's going into reserves now. I don't know if you declare them one at a time, or you... I, I don't care. You can declare them all. I don't care. Um, but it's like, probably not going to change is in reserve, then you deploy, then another thing is in reserve, then you deploy. Um, we can look that up real quick. I got the book here. Well, here, I will let you do that whilst I deploy some things, then. All right. Well, because it does change how you deploy, or potentially... Yeah, we'll like I said, so we're a little rusty now, and I haven't seen too many um, deployments on VODs I've been watching, so... Most All people right. just well, tend to skip over them in the videos that they do. Either, either way, I have deployed Arjak up in my front middle. Okay. Alright, uh, let me figure this one out then here real quick. Okay, here's strategic reserves. Um, uh, before the battle. Setting up strategic reserves. Uh, You know, it kind of makes it sound like uh, I just have to declare it all at once. So I guess I'll declare it all at once. Um, kind of like how you declare transports. Um, so those are all in strategic reserves. The Terminator's Chaplain and Lysander. They can be teleported okay, striking. Sure. So with, that means I need to put down something. <laughs> and I don't know where your... This is the problem. I don't know where your heavy things are going to go. And I need my predator to have lines of sight on that. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. 
Uh, well, here's the beautiful thing. I have lots of heavy things. You should be worried. Um, I'll put them up over there. Okay. Oh, and your teleport strike is nine inches. Nine inches away, away. from an enemy, right? Yeah. So if I come in, I have to make a ten-inch charge. Because it's, I cannot be within nine, which means that I have to be, you know, only as close as nine point zero 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 whatever one. I need ten inch charge. No, it's only a nine inch charge. That's a ten. I, I know for sure it's a ten because that's what people oh, okay. explain the rules as how oh, okay. it works. Um, shite. What do I? Th Hold on, chat. I'm trying to figure out what the shite I'm doing here. Um. Oops, I need this here. Hold on. Okay, that is... I'm going to deploy my Razorback. Okay. Over there. Yeah, nice, nice. Um... Uh, yes, we'll leave it there. So now I gotta deploy See, the predator. Giant lanes down the side that fucking terrify me here. Yeah, I think the problem is no matter where I put the predator, you can always put your dreadnoughts on the other side. But your dreadnoughts and your, unless you guys just want to get into melee anyway, so they're probably going down the middle. So I think I need to keep it somewhere like right here almost, and I kind of have a lane to the side if I want it. And then can also pull up and get up, you know, I can see through this cover and shoot you. Shoot weapons movement. Oh, it's only six. Okay. That's my thoughts on it. I might totally be wrong. <laughs> um, yep, see, and you just counter deploy. Do you have anything left? Nope. All right, I got my... So I have my two regular dreads left here. Okay. So I'm going to deploy ranged dread there. And then we are going to put... Melee dread. I want this guy right behind our jack. I just don't know if I can get him there. That works. There we go. Okay. Nice. All right. Beautiful. And then I have... Here, hold on. Let me move my... I'll spin my gray hunters around behind my deployment zone here. So those guys are in the Razorback. Okay. Nice, nice. The Vulka Fenrika are ready. All right. And the Imperial Fists are ready as well. Um, yeah, one rule uh, as well. You, so you have to be within three to hold the point, but you also hold it after you capture it as well. Because we both have OPSEC. Well, yeah. yeah, well, we both have OPSEC, but the rule is that uh, until you counter capture my point, uh, or I counter capture your point, you automatically hold it for the purpose of scoring. Oh. Yeah. So we can just put like little dice on them or something to represent that when we capture it. That works. Um, yeah, all right. And then that actually works with my banner, uh, raise the banners as well. Did I mention I'd raise banners? I think I mentioned my secondaries. Yes, you anyway. did. Yep. Okay, cool. So, because you have, while we stand, we fight, engage on all fronts and raise the banners. I have Slay the Warlord, engage on all fronts, and then the Space Wolves one where I get points for either being in melee or charging. Because, oh, right. a woo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Abu, glomps you. God damn it. <laughs> um, it slices you in half with the power axe. Oh, whoa. <laughs> uh, if if we're feeling nice, yes. <laughs> um. All right. Wonderful. Let's roll off for first turn. All right. Hold on. Let me. Oh, I can dumpster some dice here. Here we go. All right. Ready? Yep. <laughs> One. <laughs> Two. Damn it. <laughs> oh, uh, I love it. Okay. Um, in a game like this, I feel like having the first turn is good, especially because I'm going into you a melee army. And I get to have two shoots before your 
before you have two moves. I'm going to take well, this. The, the, you are probably right. The counter theory to that is I am very well hidden right now. Mm -hmm. Do you want to go first and move and give me a chance to just bust out and start wrecking shit? I also got to worry about my deep strikes. So if you start taking a lot of space, my deep strikes won't have as much room to come on in. You're also right. I forget that you do that. I, I don't. Mo well, mostly because I think the only unit I have that could deep strike is Arjak, mm -hmm. and I just didn't. Because <laughs> he's the, if he was my warlord, there's some hilarious space wolf shit for having your warlord in enemy territory. <laughs> but oh, I digress. Let me do the math real quick. Uh, two seventy plus one ninety five is. 365, 465. Okay, cool. Now this is good. I'm just double checking that uh, you had to uh, buy rolls, have half your points value on the table. I was just double checking that this wasn't have my points value. Oh, it's, okay. it's close, but it isn't quite half. I didn't even know that was a thing. So there you go. Uh, yeah, because it keeps the crazy null deployment shenanigans from happening. All Wait. right. Um, I'm really wondering if it's a mistake by deep striking, but whatever, we'll do it. It it probably isn't because my army is so melee focused. If you can get me on both sides, you can just hammer an anvil it. Mm -hmm. Like realistically here. So yeah, you could spread right, out anyway. units more next time than try and deny deep strikes. But whatever, it's probably not a big deal. You got a lot of unit, a lot of melee everywhere in your army. Yes. All right, well, let us begin. My turn one. Start the game. All right. Um, so command phase, I gain a point and nothing else happens. Movement phase, here we go. Now things start happening. Um, I want to start measuring stuff because I don't know. Hmm? Pipes, is that you sitting in chat talking about if the emperor had a text-to-speech device? Because if it is, thank you. <laughs> no, that's uh, DJ Griffith, that's Owen. Oh, sh oh, see, here's the problem. I forget who it all is. Hi, Owen. Wait, is it the game text to speech? Hold on. TTS. Oh. <laughs> He's probably not talking about if the emperor had a text to speech device. That took me a minute, Owen. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> I love tabletop. I double checked. Apparently, I was still streaming on World of Warships, so I just changed it. Oh, all right, okay. we're good. Uh,. If I move up six, so the range on the autoboat rifles, which, by the way, are disgusting and usually the right way to go, is 24. Okay, I can hit you with a normal move. But if I want to hit this objective, I have to advance. So I'm going to try and advance. Okay. Uh, those intercessors. Four for a total of 10, especially since they're assault. That's good. All right. There you go. And that gets me in just barely in range of the objective. Wait. Oh, it's tab. Okay. Yeah. Every time we play, I have to remember how the fuck this works. <laughs> um, it's going to sound weird. I'd probably have an easier time playing this on a tabletop. Hmm. Uh, Predator Annihilator is going to have a scooch. So I'd say about there. Wait, can I see you? Okay, I can see your dreadnought from the right side of my guy, so I can hit it. Yes. Yep. Uh, I think if you honestly wanted, there's also my one of my blood claws. You can see him in front of the dreadnought. So I will let you decide what you'd like to take targets on. Okay, yeah, perfect. Because they are, they are essentially in that same plane, so I will let you decide what you'd like to uh, assign hits to. Okay. Yeah, How did yeah. you get those guys under there? Uh, I don't know. I just kind of dragged and moved them, and they kind of, <laughs> it kind of worked. Don't think about it, chat. Don't think <laughs> about it. It works when you're not paying attention. <laughs> if, if, pray to the Omnissiah, and don't think about it. 
Um, move these guys up here. And this guy's going to be a little bit more back to the side. <laughs> Sorry, I stepped away for as long as it took for, for Josh to get my joke. What did I miss? Uh, <laughs> Just, if it wasn't for the fact that if I flipped the table, it would take 20 minutes to get back to this point. Oh my god. Um, um, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, and my rage burns like half your state did a couple of months ago. So. <laughs> Oh, love it. Sorry, that was a low blow. Oh, I love it, I love it. Um, love, we're, we're trying shade here for good. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Glad to have you here, brother. All right, that's all for movement. Sidekick, got none of it. Oh, um, you know what I forgot to roll is the hand adorn, uh, D3 command points extras. Yes, kick at the beginning. So two. Two, two command points. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I'm excited. I actually knew what that meant. Alrighty. So, shooting phase then for me. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, well, maybe a little. This is light cover and obscuring, but you're in here so I can see you. Uh, your blood claws, uh, especially still on the bottom floor, so... Let's see who has vision on ya. And like I said, all my guys are on the bottom. I just couldn't drag them down there. Right. So the squad here can see you. Um, your blood claws in there. I guess they can also shoot here. That's probably more what I do. One guy's out of range, but everyone else can hit. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be shooting with this tactical squad here, and they're going to be taking shots into that, uh, that blood claw kind of screen you got going on over there. Okay. So I got... Two bolters and a storm bolter in range. Um, they moved. Oh, oh, two hits. And then we're gonna need a four to wound because the toughness is four, right? Correct. All right, on those guys. Uh, I know they don't have something the same. Oh, never mind. I guess they might have been buffed. I thought they didn't have enough ballistic skill or something compared to other guys. Or... I guess I'm wrong. That might have been last edition. All right, but one save for you. All right, and that is It a... is a uh, first turn, which means we're in Devastator Doctrine. So, okay, that doesn't affect Bolters this round. Three up! Hey! hey. Nice. All right. Um, I'm going to take the squad here. They're going to be shooting at your blood cause that's in this building. I think... Theoretically, the heavy bolter should have see you because its buildings are weird. You have built so you have windows on the first floor, which I think just makes the whole floor permeable. Essentially, is the rule, and I think this guy's obscured by obscuring terrain. So, yeah, I, I think only these two guys can shoot. Yeah. 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 All right. Oh wait, you know what? I forgot the heavy bolter in the first squad. Let me do that real quick. Because they didn't shoot at your blood class in the middle. Um, they did buff that. It is now heavy 3, strength 5, AP minus 1, damage 2. So that damage 2 is awesome. Um, heavy Bolter. Do it. Strength 5. So I need... On 3s. On 3s. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Um, dang. Didn't even get that Devastator. Woof. Indeed. All right, so the that squad in the middle is shooting at your squad in the building. The storm bolter got one hit, and it's a wound. Building squad. Uh, is there any AP on that? No. I make it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because Blickhaws do have that three up armor. Yes. Nice. It's the 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 thing that they really have that hurts them is headstrong, but I just don't care. Mm -hmm. So. Um, oh, okay, I get two exploding sixes on my second attack. So, four hits, because I'm a Imperial Fist. Roll it. Alright, time to wound. Need threes. Three wounds. Uh, at AP minus two. 
Ooh, that is. I need some five ups. I get one. Two of them go through. Yep, two of them go through. It deals two damage, so two guys are flinked off. And that's. Wait, hey, hold squad? on. That's the squad. Or the building squad. Okay. Um. There we go. Okay. Um. And then your characters are all hidden. But my guys can see you. They just have to shoot at disadvantage. So this is why Autobot rifles are disgusting. They just get so many shots. Um, plus, look at the auxiliary grenade launcher. Do I get shoot that in addition? I was never 100% on that. Wait, what was the question? The auxiliary grenade launcher. Oh, I have no idea. Um, So it's a 30 inch blast or crack. Doing. I got it. Um, sure, I had it, but it's not on my list. All right, whatever. No big deal. I don't have it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's 21 shots. Um, they they advance, so they shoot up minus one, so it's forced to hit. Uh, right. I'm actually going to use the uh, Ultra Drill stratagem here. Mm -hmm. So until end of phase, when resolving an attack made by a model in that unit with a bolt weapon, an on mod five hit of six scores an additional one hit. So it's like doubling down on that uh, ultra drill thing that you have. <laughs> so any sixes good. added two extra hits here. That's two CP for that stratagem. Oof. Hitting on four sixes are, oh my God. Lots of sixes. Jesus. So 12 more. So this mini is... <laughs> Holy crap! And what is this against? This is against your blood claws right here. Oh Jesus! All right. So good luck to them. Um, forced a wound. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten. Three ups. Ah, oh, two. Oh my right. God! Nice. Oh, you, you lose one guy. Oh, it's just dam It's just one damage. Yeah, it's one damage. Oh, thank Christ! <laughs> Yeet. It's just the volume of fire that's disgusting. Like all those exploding sixes. Holy crap! Yeah, tell me about it. All right. Uh, and then finally, the Predator Annihilator. Uh, the Predator Annihilator is going to shoot its last cannons, storm bolters out of range, um, and then the health fire missile. All at that venerable dreadnought, right there. Bring it on, father mucker. So, all right, I'm going to start with the hunt uh, hunter killer missile, string ten, heavy one, AP minus two, damage six. Okay. Ooh, please hit. All right, it hits. Being strength 10, you are uh, toughness 7. So 3 is to wound. Oh my god. Um, I'll, I'll spend a CP here. Uh, okay. Fails to wound. The Emperor protects! <laughs> Indeed. Right, hold on. That's my line. And then the last cannons. No idea what those do either, but okay. Last cannon. Uh, two hit. I believe there's strength in nine, so three's to wound. Yep. And then, yeah, it's been a while, so AP minus three. So that's two wounds. Uh, AP minus three gives me a six. Six up save. Uh, yeah. Wait, how many attacks did you make? Uh, four. Because I have duty eternal, and that reduces. Uh, though, yeah, when we take when you take the damage, we'll 
modify that. So you have to or save it first. It reduces the number of attacks, not damage. A number of attacks? Yeah, each time an attack is allocated, subtract one. Oh, subtract one from the damage characteristic. I'm a fucking dumbass. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Sorry, how many? Sorry, chat. Taking uh, a minute here. Two. Six up. Oh, baby. <sighs> nice. So I got one. All right, so it's going to be D6 damage, I believe. Um, yep, D6 damage. <laughs> and I can't reroll that. One. Uh, it cannot go lower than one. And, and you I can't have go lower. Six feel no pain. Yeah, and you got the feel no pain. Okay. Ah, damn it, okay. You're down one. <laughs> damn I, it. I will tick him down one. Your predator just unloads oh. and my guy's just like, all right, cool story, bro. You just shrugged it off. Holy crap. I don't give a shit. That six up save was big. That one on the damage was big. Yeah, that six up save is insane. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's my charge phase, but I don't think anyone's even in range to consider it. So, uh, fight morale. Uh, you do so, morale. I have, so this squad of blood claws uh, is down to five, so I need. Wait. So yeah, you can fail it on a... It's the number of units I lost, right? Yeah, I believe you fell on a so, six. Don't get a six. Okay. Yeah. And then the other one, I lost a unit, so I can't fail. Because six plus one is seven, which is my leadership. Yep, I believe that's right. So I cannot fail the um, other one. Let me, let me double check if it's meets or beats. I think you're right. I think you're, you can't fail it, but I just want to double check. It's been a while for me, too. Yeah. Oh, you know what I need? You know, there's like some Warhammer 40k like background music things you can do. Oh, it'd be so good. Yeah, 40k battle ambiance. Yes. See, the problem is I won't be able to hear it because I have the stream muted because I hate hearing myself twice. So chat, you enjoy that while I sit here in awkward silence. You know what, actually? Hold on. You, you can follow it up yourself. I can send you the link. <laughs> you should. It was either that or I was just going to play a shit ton of Viking metal. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, mate, I'm Space Wolves. That's what we do. That works for me. Yes. Okay. All right. Ah, oh, beautiful. Battle ambiance. That, that's a little bit of something for the background, too. Which is nice. Good. Okay. All right. Battle round. Shooting. Making. Charge. Fight. Rail test. Yep, um, the last. And then, if it, the uh, rail exceeds the unit's leadership, yeah, so you have to exceed the unit leadership, so you have to okay. keep the number you don't have to meet. Okay. Yeah, so you don't lose any. Yeah, just take rail there. Sweet. Okay. Alright, well, at the end of my turn, um, after morale, because I didn't lose anything. It's your turn, but I had to score my secondaries, so I got... Uh, I didn't raise any banners, so I don't get that. Uh, I'm not on all fronts, so I don't get that either. And while we stand, we fight is at the end, it's so... It's an end of game, okay. Yep. So, it is my command phase. I have incremented. Uh, it increments uh, automatically. Oh, okay, yeah, perfect. Yes, which is very nice. <laughs> Uh, movement phase. Ah. A question for you. Yeah. If my Razorback rolls out, my Grey Hunters hop out, can they charge? Uh, I don't believe they can charge from disembarking after moving. They can disembark now and charge. I don't think they can nah, move and disembark. Okay. Uh, so my Razorback has a movement of 12. Uh, I'll double check that out. That's the case, unless you have a specific vehicle that allows you to do that. Oh, this is lovely. Ahem. Hi, Adam. Oh, hello, you're right in my face. <laughs> uh, let's see, Bjorn's got six. Okay, remind me, because I forget, what do I not get to do if I advance? Uh, if you advance, you 
shoot assault weapons at minus one and you don't shoot other weapons. Um, what else? Yeah, basically, you, you just you can't charge either. Okay, so we are not we are not going to do that yet. So we're going to go. We're going to get you boys up here. I think we're gonna put these blood claws up here, kind of in this, kind of in this corner here for now. Get them um, nice and tucked in. Saying that you can move this in part. Okay, well, it says here if a unit disembarks set up on the battlefield, so it's fully within three inches of the transfer model, not within engagement of enemy models. And then the inside disembark can act normally uh, for the remainder of the turn, including fighting. Um, but it counts as moving that turn. Okay. So I think you can't disembark and charge. Oh, did I hear disembark and charge? Yeah. I heard. Chat, did you hear? Chat, did you hear what I hear? <laughs> did you hear what I hear? You said it's wholly within three inches, right? Yeah, it has to be wholly within three. Which that wording specifically means it has to be within the three inches. But... I'm gonna just wholly within. This. Yeah, it ends up with this weird differentiation between within and wholly within. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense to me, mm -hmm. but. Well, actually, no, I think, well, no. I think it's smart, ultimately, at the end of the day. I think it is very smart. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, so the only people that haven't moved are, way the shite back here, okay. Um, oh, our jack can only move five. Well, does it matter? Um, hold on. So I've got assault one. Um, you know what? We're going to advance our jack here. Yeah, I'm not seeing saying anything specifically saying you can't charge after disembarking. So our so jack gets seven. Jack the Rock. Probably not grouping my uh, units right, but that's besides the point. And then this dread we're going to advance. Big boy. Oh, yeah. All right, so he gets nine. Keep in mind, you are leaving our Jack a bit vulnerable there. Like, if I want to roll up my Predator, because he is the closest guy. Oh, yeah, good point. So yeah, I can shoot the predator of the space marines if he's the closest. Um, yeah, we'll swap, we'll put this dread over here then. We'll swap him and Arjak, essentially. And then, um... Alright, Swap Bjorn. Alright, yeah, we'll, we'll just move Bjorn here. Okay. Oh, Bjorn's gonna be scary. All right, ladies, gentlemen, and those undecided. Um, let's okay. Let's start with the one everybody wants to see. Let's start with this venerable dread. All right, fighting or shoot uh, or psychic, yeah, I guess. We, uh, well, oh, sorry. Hold on. <laughs> psychic. Hey, hey, Magnus or uh, hey, Russ. Isn't Rune Priest just another name for Psyker? Shut your ignorant mouth, Magnus, you slut. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right all right shooting phase all right so we're gonna start with the big one uh this dread is going to go with its um 
Hellfire cannon focused into um the the pressure. Uh, okay, am I better off with the dispersed or the focused? Um Heavy D3, strength six versus focuses strength eight, AP four. You get a lot better AP with the focused. Okay, we're gonna do focused. And yes, uh, that's so roll random for the dispersed anyway. So strength is great, AP is great. Um, my it's just one. It's just one attack, right? My toughness is seven, so you also wound better. Um, yeah, it's one attack. Okay. See, the problem is I know how to read melee. <laughs> It's a it's one attack. Uh, it's not, it's a ballistic skill okay, two so up because you're venerable. Yep. So that hits. Um, now you need a three to wound. Oof. Um. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, and it does so much more damage during the focused. D three plus three versus just D one. I'm not within enough space. Okay. Um, you know, I'm going to let that go because I don't care enough to reroll that. I uh, really don't want a command point? All right. Uh, no, I want to save it. Sure thing. Uh, I think it'll be more useful later. Uh, well, these blood claws can't really see anything. Okay. Uh, what is it? What the hell? Sorry. This. What is this blood... Do you see a blood claw just chilling in the middle of the map, or am I just going crazy? Um, right there? You're going crazy. <laughs> okay, I'm going crazy. Got it. Okay. Um, no, it's way out of range. Okay. Uh, I got a couple of boys what can see over here. Uh, I've got my three boys what can see, so we'll shoot uh, over here. Okay. So we'll go... Oh, wait. Shit, I, for... I thought those... I forgot those were my Grey Hunters. I have nobody in range, so never mind. Um... Uh, look us over two... here. Yeah, they only have pistols. Yeah, yeah. they're in range. Um... Shit. All right, let's do Bjorn into the Intercessors. Okay. Uh, and we are going to do the, uh, uh you got focused and dispersed. Um, you can potentially probably want dispersed. The only problem is that's one damage. So you need to hit two dispersed and wounds versus one focused to kill one of my guys. Let's go with the Hellfrost focused. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah, we'll probably go. actually the better way to go. Yeah, we'll go with the focus. So that's what, two up because I'm Bjorn? Yep. Okay, I hit. And two then... up. <sighs> I don't fucking wound. Um... Oh, really? Roll the one? Oh. Yeah, roll another one. Ouch. Okay. Um, we'll do the... Uh... The question is, how much do I just want to dust this? How much do I want to dust your intercessors versus dust over here? Uh, intercessors are definitely higher po firepower compared to these guys with all the auto boat rifles. All right, so um, we're gonna take everything from the Razorback. Right, there's, I guess there's like the heavy bolter, but like I, I think there's just so much more firepower with all the auto yeah. boat rifles here. So we're gonna take everything from the uh, heavy bolter or from the Razorback into you. So if it's rapid fire two, what does that mean? Uh, if you're within half, you can fire it twice. So you get four shots on the Storm Bolter. Okay, so four shots on the Storm Bolter, and the Twin Heavy Bolter is six? Yep. Okay, so we will, do, nice. uh, we will do blue for the Storm Bolter. And then green for the... Whatever the other thing was. Okay. Three to hit. Nice. All right. So scrub those. All right. So with the storm bolter, you're gonna need fours. With the heavy, you need threes. 
So, just that one doesn't hit, or doesn't wound. Okay. Alright, so... <clears throat> uh... That means it's four heavy bolter hits, two storm bolter hits. Okay, so your storm bolter is AP minus zero, your heavy bolter is AP minus one. Okay. Two and four. Alright, well, let me do the storm bolter first. Three up. Oh, no. Um, one intercessor goes plunk. Um, take that one. Um, and add two more. So, with the AP minus one, they need a four up to save. Oh my god. Holy crap. Um, I really, really don't know how to tell you this, but the twin heavy bolter is D2. Yeah. It is. <laughs> Just yeet? Question mark? <laughs> wow. Um, okay. Say is a choice. All right. I mean, they're also another AP minus one because uh, Devastator Doctrine. I think they benefit from oh, yeah. oh, wait. Are they core? I don't think Razorbacks are core. Actually, they might not benefit from that. Uh, no, they're not. Okay. Okay, so... Uh, wow. Then we're gonna do... Thin them out real quick. Okay, so then we're gonna take my bolt guns, so... Uh, everybody gets two shots, because we're rapid fire one, so that's ten shots into the intercessors. Mm -hmm. Alright, hold on, let me... Let me uh, well, the, this. the pack leader has got a pistol, I believe. Right? Or does... Oh, he does have a bolt gun, you're right. So that's, we've got 10, and that's what, three up? Yep. Three up, jeez, I cannot <laughs> for life me. 10 three ups to hit, okay. That's fours. And then you're gonna need a four to wound. That's four. There we go, and that's just straight. Um, yeah, an extra AP because we're in depth, or er, tactical doctrine. So that means three failed saves. Uh, so that's three damage. Yep, just one wound left on that lone guy. I think that's all my shooting. Let's move to the fun part. Wow, absolutely demolished my intercessors there. <clears throat> um, can I ch fail this charge? Uh, theoretically. It's well, given game. that I only have to get within one inch, that puts me at 1.6. I cannot fail that charge. But I shall roll it nonetheless. Yeah, you need to roll to see how much you can move in anyway. Ah, uh, plenty enough. Yeah, we're good. Um, I am going to... Hi, boys. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay. So now, uh, that is the only thing I will declare a charge with. Sorry, did you want your overwatch? No, not really. Maybe if okay. I still had like six guys left. <laughs> All right. Oh no, my Grey Hunters don't have Berserk Charge. That makes me sad. Aww. Uh, You're, you I only get to make 10 attacks All instead of 15. Oh, yeah, only Shock Assault and uh, plus one from the Chainsword too. Uh, oh, you got a power fist, actually. Oh, that's... Oh, shit. Yeah, that's right. I forgot that. Okay, so hold on. Hold on. I fucked that up. Okay, so I get eight. And then two power fist attacks. Uh, I forget what a power fist is. Oh, wait. Three power fist attacks. Um, okay. three, minus one three day. for the power fist? Yep. God damn it, son. What is what? What is happening? Okay, let's try this again. Yeet. Ooh. Okay. Lots of misses. It's good for my okay. lone wolf. Uh, I guess I shouldn't say that. I am not the wolf's ear. That has to do good things. I think the power fist might just pulverize them. Let's see. Uh, let me double check the stats on that. Yeah, because it's AP minus three, damage to you. Okay. If you minus three, which puts him to a six up, let me roll that first. 
Yeah, he's pulverized by the fist. <laughs> Damn, I should have taken first blood. Okay. Uh, and then I will... Hold on. I didn't I think you'd get this far. Shit. I actually meant to have all this shit fluffed open here. I forgot you oh, could on. charge turn one like that. So that I am going to... Um... So that is now when I consolidate? Yeah. You move three inches okay. anyway. So I'm going region. to spend a CP for a Space Wolves specific stratagem, Relentless Assault. Oh. When a Space Wolves unit from your army consolidates, each model in that unit can move an additional three inches for that consolidation move. Oh, inches. Nice. So I have a six inch consolidate. Okay, so it's basically to that crux corner there. There is a stratagem I could use that. Might have saved a few lives. Oh well. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it just would have given me a six of field no pain, which isn't reliable, I guess. Isn't reliable. Well, is isn't that reliable? Yes. Okay. Uh, I will end my charge phase. Boy, I'm way out in the open. Uh, oh. Uh, Shit's fight. dead. Yeah. <laughs> Morale. Um, <laughs> I got no morale. <laughs> okay. Uh, so then, end of the turn, uh, we do not score prime. Wait, shit, where's my notes go? Okay. So we do not score primaries. Um, I did not score warrior pride because only one unit charged. I have not slain your warlord. I will, however, score two points for engage on all fronts. Yep as I have units in three table quarters. Yeah, wonderful. All right, All right. my command phase. Uh, so I get five points for hold more. Or sorry, not hold more, um, hold, one. hold one. And I do not have hold more because you have that one over there. Your raised back's taking that. Oh, and you have that. So you, you will get hold more if I don't take another here. You are uh, welcome to try. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, yeah, the secondary zone score, so I just get five points here. That's kind of rough. Moving phase. Well, at the end of moving phase, that's when my reserves come in, I believe, so. Wait for that. Yep. And yes, it is end of movement. Um, this guy's gonna stay still, take an action. I think that might be on shooting phase to take an action, but. Are you raising banners? Yeah. Okay. I kind of want cover. I don't know if they're going to go up. Um, this guy's just going to boop, boop, boop. kind of rotate a little. Okay. Uh, really, I don't have too much movement. All right, so uh, I'm going to get my reserves in. Teleport strike happening. So I could... I'm in right... Uh, keep in mind, I do have units right there. What just happened? Oh, yeah, you do. Uh, I press Control z Uh, did I accidentally boof you? I forget Control z doesn't actually undo. It, like, reverses no, time. You're, you're good. All it did was... Uh, took you back to when you drag guys in, so. Oh, and that's away from the objective too. I am a god and I did not even know it. Oh. It's like, the, yeah. Oh, two by oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, there, Theoretically, if you one. wanted to. <laughs> if you want to, I'll mark it. All right, yeah, there I'll do go. that. So bring it in the Terminators. Oh yeah. Burning it in the countryside, burning it Found in the peasants. One tiny little <laughs> opening there. Let me make sure I'm not nine. And my shander in the back. Oh my god, I can't believe there's just one tiny little gap. God, I knew I should have fucking Wait, advanced. Hold on. I mean, do you consider that? I, I will call that, yes. Okay. For, for the sake of the memes, I will call <laughs> okay. that. Okay. Bruh. 
Bro, you think I actually care? I'm just here having fun. <laughs> it's, it's true. Oh, uh, but I might need to shoot these guys instead of raising banners. Hmm. Okay, uh, that's my movement. Psychic got none shooting. Um, the Lindy's. This is gonna hurt. For those who are curious, this is gonna hurt. Oh god, I'm worried. I don't think it will. Uh, I'm armor. I believe you do that. You have to roll. Basically, four up to use a chaplain ability. Let me just double check that here. You're barking up the wrong tree. Alright. I rolled d6 on a three up. Okay. That's a three up. For a chap. Okay. Um, so that means I'm gonna use probably Canticle of Hector. And uh Probably a litany of hate again. Um, uh, how many turns are we playing? Uh, up to five. Okay. Sorry, I'm tracking score manually. Oh, gotcha. Oh, are you yeah. keeping. So, Alright. Yeah, and I've got a breakdown of uh, everybody's primaries and secondaries. Because remember, sometimes they cap out. Yeah, yeah, not yeah, you're right. I, not that I think that'll happen, but that way, too, we can look at it and recap, so. Um... Also, okay, so Master of Sanctity chat... was also a, a CP, apparently. Let me subtract one. I forgot about that. Wait, what uh, was? Master of Sanctity, uh, my chaplain gets a second thing they can use. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, so I can recite two. So I'm going to use Mantra, or Canticle of Hate. Aura. Uh, I need to roll three up to make it happen. I'll just explain what happens if it does. Okay, so that's up. That works. And then the other one, which is Litany of Hate, is not inspiring. They do not find it inspiring. All right, so the Canticle of Hate, um, any unit uh, that's within six inches of Freeze adds two for the charge rolls made for the unit. Uh, then every time I make a pilot or consolidation move, I can move an extra three inches. And that's not a psychic ability, is it? No. The other one was a aura reroll hits, and that didn't. That was not inspiring. They did not find it inspiring. But neither of those are psychic powers. No. Damn it. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, sorry. What, just one thing to note for the future. Mm -hmm. uh, I have a stratagem that just lets any of my units take a deny the wish test. Oh, neat. Just any of them. Nice. If you're within 12 inches. <laughs> yes, this was a great. <laughs> Fuck you, Magnus, you nerd. <laughs> sorry, Gary. All right. So, all right, shooting phase. This uh, chaplain over here is going to shoot the, ga the blood cause in there. Uh, can he rapid fire? Yeah, he's in 12. Also, chat, I'm currently listening to Windrose and their album Winter Saga, if you would like some uh, beautifully inspired Viking metal to go along with this instead of 40k background noise. Oh my god, that was my two wound roll. <laughs> it, was, it was like two and three ones. Uh... That's a good thing, I wasn't even paying attention. See, here's the secret, chat. Just don't pay attention to what your opponent's doing, you'll win. <laughs> Alright, a predator's gonna take uh, shots over there at your venerable. S please send one. Um, is in range for Storm Bolter on the off chance that that becomes useful. Alright, roll the hit. Two hits. Needs threes. Two wounds. Alright, I believe you have a six up save. Uh, 
Uh, what's the AP on it? Minus three. Yep, so n now we're six up, so two of them. I make Ooh. neither of them. Okay, let's fail. Uh, roll on the wounds. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Two wounds? Two wounds. Six up, feel no pain? I'll take two. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you will. Five. Um, five. I'd storm bolter into that guy as well in case it <laughs> the if that storm bolter ever becomes relevant son of a it doesn't yeah. <laughs> um doesn't do anything okay all right uh these guys oh, wait. oh yeah it wouldn't have mattered because it was you rolled ones for your damage anyway don't mm. I keep forgetting um, about Duty Eternal, but it's literally never been relevant. <laughs> Alright, this these squad's gonna take a shot into the Blood Claw, so these Space Marines. Yeah, go for it. Um, because... Alright, no rapid fire, which means five, storm, or five shots with bolters. No exploding. Need fours. Two wounds. Two wounds. Uh, and you don't get cover because of uh, chapter attack, by the way. But and usually you would. any AP? Nope. Uh, right, it's Devastator I mean, Doctrine because it's second turn. Mega Bolt? Oh, sorry. Sorry, it is Tactical Doctrine. There is um, AP. So then I make one fail one. Okay. Uh, and then. One wound? Yep. All right, so All right. two hits for the Heavy Bolter. And two wounds. Uh, AP minus one. Four ups. All right, I lose and blood claw. Yep, the wounded one that you had earlier. What was, do you remember what the thing was to flip them? F. Or Press F okay. to flip. Favorite specs. Uh, all right, so those guys shot. I think these guys aren't very efficient if they shoot that and storm, the heavy bolter can't hit that guy anyway. So we're going to shoot these guys again with the, with the, the tactical squad over here. Okay. Uh, do I got any? Nope. No rapid fire. Once again, five bolter shots. Freeze. Two of them hit. Oh my god. Someone's watching me fail while rolling dice here. Uh, one wound. Damn, I should have shot the heavy bolt first. It would have been more efficient. Thank it. Okay. Uh, heavy bolter. Three's hit. And a three wound. So one wound at AP minus one. Make it. Nice. Bruh, the Emperor protects. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I can't believe Why I rolled double ones on my last there? cannon wounds. <sighs> All right, well, it's, uh, it's time to try to make something happen here. That's going to be a, I believe, a 10 inch minus two will be an inch, eight inch charge because of the uh, litany. Wait, why am I rolling? Eight dice. <laughs> because you said an eight, so your brain just assumed it was eight dice. No, it's, an, <laughs> it's an eight inch charge. Eight inch charge. Um, no, I'll spend a command point on this. It's, I think it's worth it. Oh, wait, sorry. To did get you in. kick in the charge phase? Oh, yeah, sorry. Oh, don't make it again. Did you fail all of them? Yeah. Uh, Man. Yeah, my turn just don't get in. Uh, I guess I could make a charge for chaplain or something but no that's that's <laughs> that kind of a nine inch charge yeah i want to keep them together damn it uh you're not even gonna let me heroically intervene with my non-characters because i'm a space wolf <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, all i want to do that was, that was a little bit less than i wanted to happen there and, and that would have gotten me Sad wolf noises. Yeah, exactly. And that would have gotten me some stuff too. Damn. 
Um, I cannot fail the morale check for the unit that lost Manas. Okay, and so. I'm good too. So, secondaries. I don't engage on all fronts. Um, you know what? I accidentally shot with these guys, so I didn't raise a banner. So, nothing there. Wow, I have no secondaries right now. Uh, Alright. Your turn. All right, so command phase. I get a command point. Uh, mm -hmm. I will score 10 points for primaries. Hold one, hold two. Nice. Um, there's I'll, lots uh, of there's lots of breaking metal going on in my headset, and it's great. Um, all right, where's Lysander? Okay, there he is. Okay. Um, let's... My guys are an OPSEC, though, which is a problem if you get your blood claws in. Let's 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 get going here. And now here's where the real action begins. Oh, right. they're they're coming. They're uh, uh, the appropriate phrase is "Oh Lord, here come." Oh Lord, ch the, the chunky the guys be coming. His great chunk to two. Okay, um, Venerable Dread Scott. I'm going to advance that Venerable Dread since he doesn't have any weapons that can shoot. Mm -hmm. mm, there is oh. a god. There is a god. Um, but if you advance, you can't charge BT dubs. Unless you have a thing that allows you to do that. Uh, I don't a think strategy. I do with this army, unfortunately. Um, right. Okay. Well, well... That is a well, melee dread, so... Because, like, because if I go six... You you end right. up pretty dang close for a charge. All right, yeah, fuck it. We're just going to do that. And okay. I'm just going to barrel over the top at you. That's going to be not going to <laughs> um, I'm actually going to leave that squad of blood claws there. Okay. Um, we're going to advance... Jack, I think. Okay. Uh, hold on. Let me do some measuring. So six. Actually, it doesn't matter. Yeah, we're gonna advance our Jack because he has his shooting weapon is assault. So we're gonna. Jesus Christ. All right, fine. Oh, uh, Hammer does have a shooting. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, Fo Hammer is fucking great. Um, it's also a decent AP and damage, holy crap. Oh, it's fucking terrifying, mate. The, the fist of the... yeah. Strength, um, strength times two for shooting? Wow. Yeah. Are you throwing this like Thor style? What's going on? Yes, literally that is what he does is he throws it like Mjolnir. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. I did I'm not realize you, this. I cannot hear you over the sound of how fucking awesome it is to play Space Vikings. Oh. <laughs> I'm ready to get smashed. Oh my god. All right, so because Bjorn's gonna go at those guys. Um, so here's the real question: Is can I get my gray hunters? Ah, oh, can I get my gray hunters? You know what I think I might do? Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna sneak my gray hunters up to this window. Oh yeah. And we're gonna catch a hammer and anvil style here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I just have no idea how I need to orient these here. Let me screw with these five guys. They've all got line of sight here. Oh, yeah. They, they all have line of sight anyway, because there's windows in the building. Okay. Um, okay. Ba basically, then... if there's windows in the building, it becomes transparent as, if, as long as there's a unit in the building. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to move my razor back, bonk, like that, so I can see everything now. Mm -hmm. And he's still holding that objective, too. Okay, um... Well, I guess not that you need to in this mode, but... Uh, and then I have no teleport strike. Uh, I have no psychic, because, uh, we don't do that. Um, also, I'm listening to the heavy metal cover of Diggy Diggy Hole, and it's amazing. <laughs> um... And it's beautiful, okay. Uh, shooting. Jesus Christ. Alright, what do we want to melt first? Ooh. Well, there's plenty of options. Well, most of your options are Terminator, Tactical, Tactical Squad. Um, I guess from this angle, you can hit my chaplain directly. I didn't realize that. 
Well, so first things first, I'm gonna take these two blood claws into pick a Terminator. I don't care. They did them. Uh, one hit. That probably wounds. Blood claw with a what? Oh, uh, it's just a pistol shot. Okay. Just w w one wound. I guess I have a crack grenade too. That probably does oh. well. Uh, actually, so, yeah. Could I throw that instead? Oh yeah. Okay. I mean, if you use those rolls, I'll, I'll, I'll let you use those rolls and say that was a crack grenade. Sure. Because they, um, they hit and wound. So that's what three wounds. Uh, crack grenade. Did they buff those? Yeah, crack grenades D three. Oh damn. Okay. Um, so if I save it, is it AP minus anything? Yeah, it's AP minus one. Oh, and sorry, no. Uh, no, sorry, it's only one hit. Sorry, one hit. It's D3 damage. I can't fucking read. Okay, and it's AP minus hit, two AP because minus you're you're in a uh, tactical phase right now, so it's AP minus two. You're going to have to remind me, so thank you. AP minus two then. That gives you, what, a four up? Um, well, I have a one up right now, so I'm, that gives me a three up if I use a storm shield. I, I think that's oh, yeah. what I'm going to do. I'm going to put on a storm shield terminator. I make it. Okay. All right. Um, and then you would roll damage us, if I don't make it, is how it works. Let us venerable dread now. Uh, oh. Hellfrost cannon focused terminators. Oof, okay, yeah, yeah. Send it. Who's hit? It. And it's uh, strength eight versus toughness. Uh, I believe it's terminators are four. Yeah, toughness four. So twos. Wound. All uh, right. AP minus four. Um, I'm gonna use a storm shield for this. It. Okay. Three up, right? Um. Well, since it's AP minus four, uh, it's actually four up in this edition. Okay. So four, four or higher. Makes it. <laughs> All right. Um. Arjack. Are we in range? Fuck yeah, we are. We're gonna Mjolnir this motherfucker. Um, well, I think I have to keep taking on storm shields too. And then, oh no, no. Ballistic skill that'll hit. Sure thing. And strength ten. Oh my god, he's strength five. I didn't even realize that. Yeah. Yeah, that wounds. Uh, so that is three damage. AP minus three. Um, Assuming you don't save. Yeah, so taking out a Storm Shield again here. Oh, that finally goes through. Roll that damage. Three damage. Oh, just flat three? Yeah. Uh, be thankful you're not a character. It's four. <laughs> um, well, it has three wounds. Um, no, I don't think I have any feel no pains for anything, so... One of those guys just goes bop. Oh, that was a sergeant. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're not that stupid. But one of your uh, storm shield guys is gone. Yep. Okay. Um. Then let's. Um. Let's. Bjorn cannot see any of the terminators. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, so I'm going to focus beam your marine, uh, focus beam your marines. Okay. Or, uh, or would I be better off dispersed? No, we're gonna focus beam. Fuck it. Focus beam. Hit. It's, I think it two just wounds. There you go. Uh, with that AP minus four, I get a six up. Don't make it. I think he just gets bopped. Uh, yeah, it's D, it's D6 damage. Oh, okay, you could roll a one. <laughs> it no. does not roll a one. Yeeted. All right, it was in this one? Right? Gosh. 20 seconds. Man, this... This game isn't going so hot for me. I really need my... So I, what I'm going to really need here to work to have a chance of winning this game... Um, my Death Star here with Lysander, Chaplin, and um, all these Thunder Hammers and Claws are really going to have to kill these Venerables and Arjack for me to have a chance here. 
even then, uh, you know, they have to get their Bjorn and I'm kind of in a tough place, you know, on the kind of cornered on my board here. So, it's, it's not good. Um, I can break out if I, if I get through this line right here is what I have to do here. But even then, my secondaries are done for, I think, for, um, uh, engage on all fronts. I'm not getting any more of those here. He's getting all of them. Okay, thank you, sir. All right. Um, okay, so we've lit things up. Um, let us... Let us gray hunters into your space marines. Okay. And you target um, this squad with Bjorn, right? I think you don't yeah, have... Yeah, I don't think you have any... Okay. Yep. So uh, we will bolt gun everybody. Sure thing. So that's ten shots, right? Yep. Okay. Your leader has a combi plasma. It doesn't. His model does. Uh, it doesn't look like he has it on his stat sheet. Yeah. It, it, I just wanted a model that also wasn't a wolf. Or that also wasn't a blood claw pack leader. Oh, okay. All right, so seven hits. Nice. And Four. on... Three wounds. Three of them. I need a little luck going my way, you know? Oh my god. All right. Will we grease another one? Yep. All right, so here's the real question is, what do I chuck the razor back at? Um... Whatever you want. You can hit this chaplain from this angle. Otherwise, you could try to finish that or do some more wounds on Terminators. Wait, I can hit the chaplain? Yeah, because chaplain's... Uh, wait. Hold on. No, never mind. Chaplain's not the closest. You can't. I lied. Um, so yeah, either that squad, that squad, or that squad, or maybe even that if you're feeling plucky. Okay. Um... So... Okay, what does it mean when it says rapid fire two again? Because I never remember. You can double tap the gun if you're in half range. Uh, you are not in half range. Okay, so it's two plus six, so I need eight. And then two, okay. Here Pretty sure I flipped the colors on you, but whatever. Uh, um, I get it. I haven't got too many sixes either for bolter guns. Is it two up? Uh, it's three up. Three or three up, I mean. Okay, so we'll take the twos out. Roll damage. I rolled a wound, I guess. Yep. I know one doesn't, but I'm guessing everything else does. Yeah, everything else, in fact, does. Uh, right. let me... So against those guys, let me roll the heavy bolters first. Those are at AP minus two. Uh, yep. So I got five ups. One save. Oh, no. One goes through. It's D2, so it greases a guy. Greases two guys. Ah. Because your heavy bolter is D2. Move. Oh, yeah. Um. And then two storm bolters? Yep. Uh, save him. Sweet. Uh, so I saved the heavy weapons guy. <laughs> heavy weapons guy. I am oh. heavy weapons guy. <laughs> and this. Okay, is I weapon. think that's. So that's all the shooting. Oh, now it's time for my favorite phase. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Um. Oh, well, let's get it over with. This is where my army's going to do its best. Um, oh, let's you... see how much we really, really want to go at here. Okay, well, uh, five inch charge. we're going to go in there. So five inch charge. Oh, no, not three dice. Just two, please. Oh. Um, so the the kicker is engagement 
range in this is one inch, so that's technically only a four inch charge. Yeah, I think that's right. I'll have to double check it. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. Here, I will look real quick so we're not sitting here going, what the hell are we doing? Yeah, no, that's fine. Because you're, you're totally right, engage range is one inch. I have no idea. It's somewhere in these giant old books I have that I just haven't had a chance to pull. Yeah, yet. continue doing that. I'll, uh... I'll, I can look it up for you. Yeet. I think. I think that's right, but oh. I know the specific reasons why you have to charge 10 inches when you come in from Deep Strike. Alright, we're gonna get the other Venerable Dread moving here. He's got a 6 inch. It doesn't matter what he has, he has an 11 inch charge, he's fucking in. <laughs> yeah, he's in. He's fucking in. Oh, sorry, did you want to declare uh, Overwatch on any of this? Uh, I don't have weapons to declare Overwatch with. That is unbloody fortunate. Um, yeah, or assault terminators. So our Jack has a seven inch charge. We're gonna try it. Oh, I'm gonna spend a CP. <laughs> I'm spending a CP. I okay. need our Jack to get in there. Okay. Yeah. Go for it. Yes. <laughs> Eleven. Hey. Holy crap, that 11. Um, you know where that's gonna put me? Yeet. Oh, baby. Um, and then just for Talal's... It looks here, right, because it has to be in, within um, engagement range. Can I kick an 8-inch charge here? Let's see. Declare 8-inch charge. Come on, boys. Nope, that ain't gonna do it. Ah, uh, unfortunate. Uh, I mean, oh well. you've got everything you need in there. Um, okay. Charge phase is over. Uh, Fight. Uh, <laughs> um, um, I'm gonna heroically intervene with the chaplain and the Lysander. Okay. Yeah. That works. All right, I have to check something here. Hold on. Lol. Okay, Arjack does have space wolves. Or uh, yeah, he does. Um. Okay, so I'm going to. See if I'd have actually paid attention. Uh, I would know what I'm doing. Um, uh, what I do you want to do? Which is, which is fine. Um, what do you want to do? I think I'm gonna kick Savage Strike on Arjack Rockfist for a CP. Uh, use a stratagem. Okay. So. Uh, because he charged until the fight is resolved, each time he makes an attack, add one to that attack's wound roll. <laughs> that is gonna be funny. Mm. I mean, he's already strength 10, but, uh, wounds are good, right? Yeah. Um, so... Because that means if I'm you... On two well, plus one, I'm basic. I wound on everything, then. Well, you already wound on a... You're strength 10, aren't you? Yeah. Or, yeah, string 10, so you already wound on two up. You can't get any better. Okay, then I will not burn the CP on that. Yeah. I apologize, chat. I'm just an idiot. Um, okay, let's see. Who's going to fight first? Well, I tell you what, let's start um, with... Yeah, because I'm probably going to interrupt here, so make your choice of who you want to fight. Oh, uh, because I forgot to give Arjack armor for us. Damn it. Um, wait. Damn it, Lysander's in the wait. Is uh, Lysander in engagement range? Yeah. No, well I can hit you for sure. I don't think you can hit him. Cause like he's in a, uh, he's uh within five inches of someone who's in melee. Hmm. Um, Highlands. Wait, does it really work like that? That's so dumb. 
because ninth edition is stupid because everything that piles in is now fighting. Because if that's true, our Jack and Lysander are going motto a motto. Oh man. Like, we're starting right there. Because that's the only thing chat cares about. Warlord v. Warlord, baby. <laughs> yeah. 1v1. Uh. 1v1 man, the rest of us. Because, yeah, you want to. Heroic intervention. And how that works. We should definitely be able to. Shoot something. All right, so I did the heroic interventions. Because now that we're fighting, everybody that's in the scrum fights, I think. Uh, yeah, so definitely in the charge. So how does the fight work? Attacks made by models and units that made a charge move this turn can only target enemy units that their unit declared a charge against or that performed a heroic intervention this turn. Right. So I declared a heroic In order to target an enemy unit, the attacking model must either be within engagement range with that unit or within half an inch of another model in its own unit that is itself within half an inch of that enemy unit. Oh, within its own unit? Within oh. its own unit, but that's for units. Oh. You declared a heroic intervention, so I can target that as well. Okay. Wait, does that mean my guy can't hit through friendlies? Yes, he can. Okay. Yep, so it it basically goes for this whole clusterfuck, Lysander, the Chaplain, mm -hmm. your four Terminators, my two Vendreds, and Arjak. Mm -hmm. Everybody can fight everybody now. Okay, all right. Yeah, welcome to the scrum. <laughs> um, all right, Arjak versus oh, Lysander. Uh, yeah, Arjak versus Lysander. So I have Champion of the Kingsguard, so whenever I make a melee attack against a character, I reroll the hits. Oh, baby. Actually, wait, hold on. Do I need to... Oh, because he's a Space Wolves infantry. Uh, assault... Do well, no, that doesn't really matter, because Assault Doctrine doesn't do me any good, does it? Uh, nah, never mind. Okay, so... um. Let okay, so let's let's just fucking go here. So I get four attacks at yeah. two up. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Do I get any bonuses because I charged? Um, you get the normal space marines ones, so one extra attack. So five. Uh, let's see what rules you got. Dink. Oh, you don't have Savage Fear yet. You're probably going there next turn, though. I'm probably going to Assault next turn, too. All right. So, I rolled two ones. I get to reroll my hits. You get a reroll of Wound of one. While of, of eight friendly Space Marine Corps units within six. Um, Tactical Precision. Is that <laughs> does that affect yourself? I don't think that affects yourself. No, sorry. I'm talking about Champion of the King's Guard that lets me reroll the hits. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> You reroll so one hit. So. You hit on a two and reroll one. One, one. So I've got five hits. Okay. Uh, strength 10 versus. Eight or four. Okay, so wounded on twos. Uh, hold. Uh, Does that affect yourself? I don't get to I don't get to reroll wounds, do I? No. Uh, you get tactical precision. I don't know if that affects yourself. I would say no. Okay. That's what, that's what I'm reading it to. So, uh, so four wounds. Four wounds. All right, Lysander over here. So um, this, so it is AP minus three. <laughs> four of them. I got a four up in Vaughn. And um, every single one of them is four damage. Oh my god. Four da oh, okay, I can't take two of them then. <laughs> so you have to make three four ups. Uh, yeah, I'm not getting anything too fancy to, to help with that. 
Oh boy. You need three four ups, baby. Very likely using a command point here. On four up, four up, four up, four up. Yep. Good yeah, reroll. No. Did we do it? Did yeah, we do it? Yeah, you done did gentlemen? it. We did it. Um, Lysander is down. Wow. I am going to just put the points for Slay the Warlord on the sheet. Yeah, that's fine. Um, all my guys are going to interrupt for two command points. And they're going right, to be who are you targeting? focused on Arjak. Okay. Um, that's two Terminators, one's a sergeant. So five attacks at wait. There's also the counter charge, isn't there? <laughs> um, counter offensive is one of the space range shots, right? You can, if you're charged, you take one extra attack. Or angels uh, of death. Yes, I think. If you, if you, uh, yes, I think so. Okay. All right. Here's the hammers. They hit on, I believe, fours because they're minus one normally. Yes. Your guy isn't because he's he's special. He's awesome. Oh wait, I am super special. Uh, is that right. three hits? Uh, it's three hits. Resume your okay. toughness. What's your toughness? Uh, I am T four. Okay. I need twos. Three wounds. All right, and I have a three up in Vuln. Or what's the AP on yours? Uh, yeah, yo, it's minus two. Yeah, I got a three up in Vuln. And you said three wounds? Yep. Uh, what is the damage? Uh, I believe they're D. D uh, three damage straight. All right, so I will take one. Okay. And then my so lightning I... claw users are... Down to two, two and then... Um, lightning claws get one additional attack with this weapon. So if you got a pair of them, you get two. I get eight attacks, and I can re-roll wounds. Wow. I wonder why lightning claws are actually really good. Oh, my mix of uh, battlefield sounds just ended. Restart that. All right, so four is a hit. Um, I'm strength four against your toughness four, so I need fours rerolling wounds. All right, that is four wounds against Arjak. Uh, any AP? AP minus two. So we'll take that three up in mold. Two hits. Whew, just two damage then. He's dead. Oh my God, I counter killed him? He's only got five toughness. He is not very, he is very, very strong, not very tough. Wow, okay. Man, it's a cry and shame he wasn't my warlord. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm who? sorry, I'm just so fucking Oh, happy. that's Bjorn? Yeah, my, Bjorn's my warlord. Oh yeah. my God, okay. <laughs> All right, so anyway, uh, back to where we were. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yeah, high, you... high fin region axe uh, blizzard shield. How are you? <laughs> Um, ah, I love this. So I get four attacks, and we are going to do, um, what strength are your guys? They're strength four, or toughness four as well. Uh, strength four, toughness four. So we're, I'm going to use the scythe. So I get to make eight attacks. Holy crap, we do get to make a lot of attacks. And I'm hitting on twos. Oops. How's I roll on my dice? Really? Really? Ooh, okay. Oh, wow. And I'm wounding on four, uh, threes. Three wounds. Two of them, and then... Uh, AP minus three. 
Alright, AP minus three. What is the damage? Only one. Oh, okay. One. I probably would have recommend the cleave because my guys have three wins each. But right. you know, you're probably right. But oh well. Um, I'll take it out on my um, shields. Okay. So four are up. Uh, one goes through. All right, and that is just one damage. And then, do you have anybody to fight next? Uh, you still get this dread here. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, because it's still charge. Oh yeah, good point. Um, we will, charge so fights. Great, so Great Wolf I just claw. interrupted you. Okay. So, Great Wolf Claw, I get four attacks? If you want to consolidate them at all, first. Oh, actually, yes, I will. Alright. Okay, so f uh, three hits. Alan, I guess. Uh, uh, strength, and that's four, strength, strength 10, 10 so, so that's two. all wound. Yep. And then it. Uh, <laughs> Jesus. Minus two. AP minus 2 D3. Have to be assigned to your storm shield, guys. Yep. That's three of them? Yep. Um, so AP minus 3. Okay, one fails for sure. And he's just greased, it's three damage. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, wonderful. Well, three you, not for me. Um, do you have any other charges? Nope, that was it. Okay. Uh, my guys are gonna pile in a little bit. Uh... And then your chaplain's got a fight back. Oh yeah, chaplain too. Well, he's got a decent weapon on him, which is awesome. He's got the um, Fist of Terra. Damn. Uh, it's one additional attack with this weapon. So it becomes five attacks for him this turn. Uh, uh, which dreads he going after? I hate going for the guy with the invulnerable save, but I think I have to do it. Go for it. All right, five attacks. He's got a two up. Let's see, what's the uh, yeah, he's got a two up. Yep. And this weapon doesn't have a minus one. So times two makes him strength. Just double checking strength. Wounding eight. on threes. I'm, t I'm T7. All right, two wounds. Um, so two involuntaries. A three up or a four up involuntary? Four up. Yep, laser shields are four up. So I take one. How much damage? Uh, it's a decent damage. This is a relic. It is. Oh, it's only D3. So it is a D3 minus one because of duty eternal. All right. Roll that D3. All right, I'll take two. All right, and then I'll roll my six up. Feel no pains. Oh, that's right. Oh, even take one. Oh my god. Just chunk. Fucking chunk. This guy is going to be a pain to get through, but I need to get all through right. him because that cleave is so destructive. Um, all right, I'm going to swing with my thunder hammer, which is. Oh, wait, no, those guys already fought because yeah. I interrupted. So uh, that's that all for the, the fight. End. All right. And I have no morale other than infinite sadness because our Jack is dead. <laughs> yeah, same here. Uh, so um, I lost turn. two Terminators, but they are leadership eight. Well, the chaplain's also leadership nine, and he's um, infectious with yeah. that. Yeah, so it, irrelevant. Yeah. Um, okay. So that being that said, this alone boy right here has to take one. Oh, yeah, because the rest of his squad is dead. Yeah, and he, uh, I think that's a fail. That's, yeah, yeah, he lost, like, four guys, yeah. 
Wait, so I'd be at nine minus four is five? Oh no, did you make it? Um, cause yeah, it's, uh, within six inches. Yeah, if you lost four, so four plus five is eight. If he's within range. Yeah, he's in range. Yeah, then you're nine, then you're good. Okay, sweet. Yeah, you're good. Barely, just cause the chapman's there. You can that on six, okay. <laughs> All right, so then I will score three points for, uh, so uh, we're done with morale. Mm -hmm. So end of turn, I will score three points for Warrior's Pride because I had, I have units in engagement range and I had units that made charges. Yep. Uh, I will score three points for engage on all fronts because I am at all four table quarters. Yep. A yeet. Um, and then I have accidentally slain the Warlord. <laughs> Accident, I think that was very intentional. I mean, it, I mean, bro, I just went four on your ass. Um, <laughs> all right, your turn. Fuck me up. All right, I can fall back and charge, right? Let me double check. Um, I don't think so. Uh, can I charge this oh. turn? You're right. Because uh, certain like because there's certain space wolves things that let you fall back and charge. Right. Yeah. Or advance and charge, which are very nice. Okay. That means, ah, uh, dang, this predator is gonna have to find himself something to be useful with. I mean. Oh, sorry. Uh. Oh crap. What's up? Oh, he's still okay, holding. Yeah, you, you do get your five for your primary, okay. Yeah, I still get five. This one is, you hold it, because you have OPSEC on the body. Yep, and then this guy is 2.6. I just measured it. I did not want, I would have felt terrible had I left one guy alive and you had pulled the wrong guy. <laughs> I lost that point. Ah, uh, whatever. <laughs> All right. Um. I got one command point, and this is spooky. I don't think the banner's gonna stay up very long if you if you move these guys, so. And you're probably gonna move these guys, so. I'm gonna move them back here. Just to have some light cover. Then these guys. These guys are gonna move up. Uh, as long as they're not engagement range. I was gonna say, yeah, you probably want to fix that. Um, uh, at least they're contesting now. I might be able to blast your claws off and control it. That's... And then... Move this guy up. That's about right. Yeah, it's got a 12 inch movement, so he's good. Perfect. All right, that's my movement. Pretty easy. Ain't got no psychic, so it's the shooting. Um, that one over here is gonna roll some canticles for this turn. Uh, Mantra's strength, which adds extra attacks and strength characteristics to the priest and damage to the weapon he has. Okay. And then the other one, which is reroll hits. Uh, where is that? Yeah. Alright, one for the priest buff. Three up. Priest does get buffed. One for the, the aura buff does not pass. Oh, Ooh. that one would have been nice. Neither of those are psychic abilities, right? Nope. They, he's just he's just yelling. He's, he's preaching on the <laughs> battlefield. He has a voice, like, he buffs himself, he's like, all right, now we go, and he goes to shout to buff everybody else, and he has a voice crack. <laughs> Basically. All right, move those guys out of engagement, and we're ready to shoot. Um, all these space marines are going to be shooting to your bullet claws over here. Uh, should all be in rapid fire. Bro, my blood claws are hurt. <laughs> I mean, they're about to be hurt. All right, that's 10. So that's three to hit. And then two explodes, so same amount of numbers. And fours. All right, we got 
six in a donger formation. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm also in assault. Out. I'm going to go to assault doctrine, so uh, oh no, I can see touch with doctrine. So it's just same AP zero. Uh, to get through, I will lose. I'm blood claw. Okay, and then I got the happy bolter. Which is minus one to hit because we moved. So it doesn't hit. Uh, the other heavy bolter is going to shoot over here at these great hunters. Well, no, he's going to shoot at, actually at that blood claw as well. Where's to hit? Okay. All right, three hits. Uh, two wounds, uh, minus one. Make him, uh, oh. make one fail one. All right, donged him. Uh, it's, is it's, it D2? Uh, it's a heavy bolter. Yeah, it's D2. Yoot, they gone. Uh, this predator is gonna hit these blood cars over. Uh, can he, does he have line sight to the Bjorn? I'm gonna say nah. It's cause there's just like the edge of this thing in the way. What's he trying to do? You're just gonna see if you can shoot your arm, but he's not in range. Or, you, or yeah, this, uh, there's this this thing's obscuring the way. Yeah, that big guy. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I guess I'll just shoot into the. Uh, I could shoot your razor back. Yeah, I'll shoot your razor back. It's a better use of the last cannons. And then the storm bolt is gonna go into the blood cause though. All right. Alrighty. So what do you want to do first? Uh, last cannons. So, three hits. Um, toughness. Seven. Seven, so a three will wound. All right, three wounds. Uh, minus three. So six up save on the razor bar. This is gonna hurt. Make one, two hits. All right, 2d6 damage. Uh, six damage. Down to four. Yikes. Yeah. All right. So all right. Sorry, to Starting to do some okay. I am still in the middle uh, category. Okay. So. Um. So the two storm bolters hit, and one wounds on the blood claws here. One wound. Fail the save. All right, one takes wound. Hey, Storm Bolter did something. <laughs> I think that's all I'm shooting. All right. Uh, charge. I probably don't actually want to charge here. So, I mean, play face. You can try, it's probably a poor life choice. <laughs> play face, all right, you go. Um, how much do I want this chaplain dead? Um, um, he's fucked himself a little bit. He has one more attack and strength and one more damage. All right, so I'll take a cleave from the uh, axe into your terminators. Okay. So that is four attacks hitting on threes. They're all going to the Terminators? Yes. Okay. He hits on three. Three hits. <coughs> Two wounds. Is he a minus one to hit? Hmm? Is he a minus one to hit? I rolled a oh, one. Oh, yeah, he does. Okay. Yeah. So all uh, right. that is two AP minus threes. I'll try and take it on the shield. Oh, he's very dead. Uh, um, as long. Oh, I should roll it one at a time. The other one wouldn't have saved a thing anyway. So. So one is dead. Oh, two are dead. So okay. three damage each, right? Uh, it's a D three plus three. Yeah, it's it's a kill. <laughs> yeah, it's just it kills every one that goes through is a kill. All right. Um. Do I want to interrupt you now? Is the question. 
Uh, I, I need to fight first before you can interrupt. Oh, yeah, good point. Oh, yeah. no, actually, it's only during charges um, that you oh, can yeah. interrupt. Oh, I'm stupid. Uh, yeah, I think I'll send the chaplain into your dreadnought. Fight me. Uh, so yeah, he's strength 5 plus attacks 4. Vortex. Wait, uh. Mr. Terror, when, the, when you fight, make one additional attack with this weapon. I get 5 attacks. Uh, hidden on 2s. And then wounding on threes? Great wounds. Uh, Wait. What's your toughness? Or what's your strength? Uh, strength eight. Yep. Wait, ten. Uh, wounding on threes. Yep. Wait, so what'd you get? Uh. Okay, now we're in. Uh, three hits. Um, three wounds. Three Ooh. four ups. Hurt. One goes through. All right. Well, at least I get plus one damage, so that kind of cancels out your minus one. Um, I think it's just a D three plus. Yep. Yeah, so D just straight D three. Because plus one minus. One. All right. Three. Woo. Uh, and then <coughs> I get my three unyielding ancients. Six up. Feel no pain. Okay. Yeah. yeah, your dreadnoughts are really scary. At axes. Half health Vendred. Yeah, I don't believe they uh, degrade it all, though, the dreads. No, they don't. They're yeah. fucking terrifying. Yeah, that's really good. They are just as terrifying at full health as they are at one wound. That's the scary part. Yeah. Is they're not dealt with until they're dead dead. <laughs> All right, your turn. Well, that's all my fights. Um, so I guess morale, I lost. Hey, I have a Vendred that hasn't smoked oh, yet. Oh, you're right, you're right. Go for it. Bruh, bruh. All right, so I get four attacks with my Great Wolf Claw. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll put this into the Terminators. I think all of that hits, because I'm, yeah. Okay. Because this this doesn't this lets me reroll either the wound or the hit. Let me look. <clears throat> Scary um, man. Yes, I can reroll the wound roll. So I am strength ten. So I'm wounded uh, on twos. Uh, four wounds, good sir. Okay, well I think I need to roll it one at a time. So, what's the damage? Uh, uh it's, sorry, it's three. Three damage. The wolf claws is uh three damage. Okay, well he fails the first one, so he's dead. And so it carries over to Chaplin. Oh god. Uh the Not Chaplin like has a four up. Okay. And he fails. Do I um You have two more of these saves to make. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. I think I just call him dead. Well, did you roll the rest of them? Uh, mm. oh, you're right. In case um, he's taken three damage. Oh, okay. So he's still at two, but he's taken three damage. I forgot those weren't um, insta chaos for him. Yeah, All no, right. He, he's scrappy. He got five. He got yeah, five. Yeah, he's got a little bit left. He's able he's to scrappy. do a little damage to Venny. Alrighty. Posh oh, Shack, thank you. <laughs> I'm watching it, brother. I'm watching it. Ah, oh, perfect. Alright, well, that's that's my fight, so morale. Um, I don't got much morale to roll. Yeah. Do you? No, you're oh, good. Uh, I cannot fail on the blood claws, because they only lost one. Alright then. So. Uh, okay. your turn then. Um, I have to rescue my secondaries. We, we forgot to score your, um, 
Oh, we stand, we fight. Uh, I engage on our front. No, raise banners. No. no. So, nothing. Shit. Okay. Wow, I've got okay. no secondaries. All right, so on my turn, uh, beginning of my turn, I will score 15 points for primary. Control one, control two, control more. Nice. Um, then... Thank you guys. Pile in at the end over here. Hmm? I think you consolidate at the end after killing. Oh, yeah. Um. I mean, if your Marines are there, I'm just gonna spin around and go towards the Marines. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a good idea. I'm, I'm gonna trust that my Vendred can deal with you. Um. I am still middle characteristic. I mean, the answer is yes. <laughs> this Razor back, but does it really matter? Now we'll leave the Razor back. Um, okay, so first things first. We're gonna we're gonna bring the boys. Bring the boys. Hi boys. Hi boys. Um and you are Oh shit, ass. It was like right there. Sorry, I thought I had the fuck ass. <laughs> um, we'll move him up to this corner, I think. He still can't see anything, and that's useless. Um, I think if you went this way, you could see the predator. I don't know what his range I is. I might actually try that. Oh, uh, but your can's only 24, but if you can get to there. I cannot, because I was here. Okay. Um, but I could go here, maybe. Okay. Well, no, I think we'll keep, uh, actually, yeah, I think we'll take Bjorn that way. So we'll actually, we'll put him Hide Bjorn. Hide. Um, is there any other movement I want to do? Not really. All right, let's. Sh uh, oh, <laughs> no psychic, Magnus, you ignorant slut. Uh, let's shoot. Okay. Uh, okay. So oh, let's. Oh, this might be painful. This might be it. So let's start with all the Grey Hunters at this poor, poor Space Marine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Adam's just. This might be a wipe here. <laughs> oh, hold on. I, I need to get rid of all these dice. Delete. There we go. Okay. So 10. It's hitting on. F fuck ass. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours? Yeah, wounding on fours. Oh, good god, that's only three wounds. Alright, I'll roll them. <laughs> He's dead. Ah, pop, 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 pop. Ah. Like that. Good. Can my, good still, can my vehicles still shoot in melee? Uh, yes, they can, which is why they're really good. Oh, good. Um. As long as they're not blast. Which means I have to use the focused Hellfrost cannon. Yeah, I believe the disperse is probably blast. Yeah, it is. Um, now the question is, do I want to fire at the Marines, the Chaplain, or the Predator? Ooh. Well, you have to, if you're in melee, you have to shoot at the Marines. Okay, well, makes that thought easy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, hitting on twos. Oh god, son of a taint. That's getting a command <laughs> point. Really? Oh, that's worth the command point. Yeah. Of all the things you can spend it on, that one was worth it. That was my shooting phase reroll. That's worth it. Uh, I guess you have enough that you can spend them. Oh yeah, I got tons of command points. <laughs> Bop. Yeah, that 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 wounds. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, uh, that takes Except a while. He's, he's dead. He's, he's dead. He's dead, Jim. <laughs> That's, yeah, he's dead. Um, 
So the thing, so my Razorback can see everything. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I guess he can. Uh, you can't shoot him because of combat. You can only shoot that guy. All right, well, congratulations. Oh, actually, am I in range? Uh, not with the Storm Bolter, but you are with the Heavy. Oh, damn it, if I had checked, I'd actually move that fucker. Okay, that's fine. Um, heavy it is. Six decks. You're gonna need that, uh, fives or more, so two wounds. Oh wait, those are those are rolls to hit, aren't they? Yeah, those okay, are. Okay, yeah, you yeah. got four hits. My my bad. And five wound, there we go. You got two of them. Two wound at AP minus one. Uh yeah, make one. Uh two damage. And I don't think, well, no, Bjorn can't see anything, so that's useless. Um, all right. Well. Okay, well, charge chase. <laughs> um, there is nothing to charge. You could charge these guys, potentially. Yeah, but then I'd be off the point. Yeah. Well, you could kind of not, you could leave some behind so they're close enough to the point. During the charge. Just put them in a string. Yeah, essentially. I mean, uh, I guess they are forced to come closer, but they don't have to. Yeah. They don't think we'll they have to make the full movement for the charges. All right. I believe you fight first. I do. Um, I hope that makes a difference. All right. I'm gonna swing at the chaplain first here. So oh, that's gonna be. Uh, does that canticle last past turns? Mm -hmm. That bit I do not know. Uh, let me... Until the end of that battle round. What's the battle round? I think it's just, uh, each battle round spin to three more turns, one for each player. Okay, I think a battle round is a full you and me. Okay. So I think I, get that. I still get that. All right, five decks. All right, one misses. I need three, so I got three. Uh, and that's a crap ton of AP, right? Yeah, cool. it's... Take it on the Blizzard Shield. Four up? Ooh. Oh! You have uh, command points. CP one of okay. Oh, no! It matters. Um, yeah, I mean... Those are all D3. Roll it. Uh, no, they're 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 just or sorry, they're flat three. Wait, no, they are D three. Yeah, sorry. Because they're D three minus one. Oh, and no, then it's plus one, D3, so it's it's just flat D three. Six damage. All right, so I get my uh, feel no pains. You Six have to save them. three of them. Oh, I take them out! Oh my god! <laughs> So the Venerable Dread goes down. Wait, does this one not explode? It does explode, I believe. Wait, does it not? Oh yeah, three inch, one mortal wound. Yep. Ooh, okay. You have to roll for it, it's out of back. No, three inch, one wound. Does that hit your <laughs> other guy? No, uh, actually, yeah, it probably does. Yeah. yeah it does. Okay. But I get my feel no pain. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> oh, 
Of course I make it that once. Is that not rollable? I thought it explodes uh, where it always rolls. Or if it is, I can roll it. Oh yeah, sorry. It's roll it on a six and explodes. Yeah, that's what it is. My apologies. Well, here, do we just want to use that for the explosion roll? Uh, if you want. Do you want to explode? Yeah, why not? Sure. <laughs> Okay, well, no. It's one, one dice is as random as another dice. We'll, All right. We'll take it. So then you take a wound. Yep. I have to see if I save. It's immortal, so I don't get a save. Man, I just can't miss today. Oh my god. You feel no pain, Dad. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Hmm. Well, it is your fight phase, so I. Good. I need to take this guy down to have a chance at winning. Uh, I'll get close enough, but he hasn't swung yet, has he? Nope. I'll move enough to not be in engagement. All right, All right. here we go. You get a swing on my tacticals here. Hmm. Ma'am. So I got four attacks. Ooh. Yeah. That, I mean, that's enough if you hit them all. On twos. Uh, what's your toughness? Four. T4. Uh, yeah, I'm wounding on twos. <laughs> Oops. Four wounds. Ah. Uh, uh, I need four sixes. Oh, wait, what is it? It's four wound AP. It's only AP minus two, so oh, you got a five. I got fives. There is a chance. There is no chance. I think they're all dead, aren't uh, they? Yeah, because it's three damage. That whole squad's... Uh, it's two or three damage, yeah. Two? Oh, sorry, three damage. Yeah, that whole squad is just gone. Yeah, like that. Ugh. Deleted. Like that. All right. All right. So. Um... Mm. There is no more fighting to be done. No. So, did you have enough people to make that secondary? Oh wait, morale. Uh, I don't. I got no morale. Cause no one's allowed to make either. it. So, um, I do not score warrior pride. I do score engage on all fronts, but I would argue only two of the three points. Because I do not think I am in this quarter. Uh, yeah, with this being kind of like the divider, these two objectives. Yeah, I would argue. Yeah, and you're not wholly within this point. one. Well, this guy's in here. Um, we're, in, we're not really wholly within this one either. We got this one. Are you, are you not in this front? Yeah, I got a I got a uh, gray hunter over there. Yeah, but the whole I think the whole squad has to be wholly within. For it to count. I never actually read it. So let me go read it real fast. Like, I know what it is, I just never read the minutia. So let me go read it. I don't think, I mean, you're, you're blowing me out today anyway. I just want to make sure I know all the rules. One or more units from your army, wholly within. Within each tip quarter. Yeah, wholly within, so... Yeah, you're not wholly within. All right, so, uh, shit, where's so my... So, no engage, actually, surprisingly, even though you're basically... Scratch that. <laughs> um... It, it's a weird little minutia. I mean, in this case, no, it doesn't yeah. matter. You're still blowing me out, but it's kind of funny. Um... Because I should be at 15... 21, 23. I should technically be at, tw well, I should be at 23 and then go to 29 because Slay the Wardler doesn't score till the end. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. But if we score that, I'm 29. Yeah, I mean, you can just edit it now because it's not going away. You're not, I'm not going to have my Warlord unslayed. <laughs> yeah, really. All right. Um, And then I will pass the turn. All right, wonderful. Um... So I got command phase, woohoo, movement phase, um, 
basically being out engaged in distance without being engaged in distance, you know. Uh -huh. Um I think I'm gonna put put this guy over a little bit. We can get a glimpse of Jorn. The Jorn the Fell Gandit. And then that's it for me. Oh psychic. Um, shooting. Let's roll the canticles for the self buff and uh, re-roll the hit. So here's the self buff. Works. Good. Rerolls. Not Good. works. Wow. Why was he? He's not very inspiring half the time. He stutters I a lot. Keep, he keeps having a voice crack. Yeah. <laughs> and they shall no no fear. <laughs> Never. We'll protect you. <laughs> Alright, Predator into uh, Bjorn for shooting. Uh, three. I really don't have anything better to spend it on, so. Uh... You know, I take solace in knowing that if you can shoot me, I can shoot you. And that is infinitely more terrifying. <laughs> Alright, um, oh, and the Storm is going to go into Blood Cause again over there. Yeah. Um, so that was it. Yorn is toughness. A lot. And I don't have rerolls, so AP. one one wound. Uh, any AP? Uh, AP my sleep. So I got a, f uh, I think Bjorn's got a four up. Wouldn't surprise me. Um, Jesus Christ. Oh no, Bjorn, uh, I thought Bjorn had it. He doesn't have anything. He so he does not have an invuln. He does have the. But he does have a five up field of pain. Okay. Huh. All right. All right. Well, I'll, uh, yeah. Roll that minus three, whatever that is. So it's just one. So that's I. Uh, it's a six up. Fuck ass. Fuck ass. Oh, I hate these dice. <laughs> All right. All How right. much damage? Doing D6. Doing one. Measly uh, damage. This so predator. He will, take, he will take a damage because of his duty eternal. <laughs> oh my gosh. How is this predator just whiffing everything for the damage? I've run like one for the damage on the last cans like three or four times. He honestly has chat. So if you're just joining us, uh, Hydra's predator over here just literally cannot do anything <laughs> Can with his last cannon it's kind of insulting actually <laughs> like, seriously you're like trained space marines man right. you need to send him you know what you know what i suspect hmm heresy <laughs> oh oh he might be a heretical print you're right time to bring in the mechanicus <laughs> All right, I rolled the storm bolter. It did nothing to them. Uh, the oh, yeah. there is a storm bolter for the uh, chaplain. He's gonna take spot shots at your guy. Uh, the, the dread. dread or... Okay. Yep. Send it. All right. All hits. I think he needs five. Okay. One wound. He's seven. One wound. Yep. Uh, any AP? Nope. We'll take that three up. I will fail that. Oh. Okay. How much damage? Just one. All right, we'll take the one. Go to half. More fun this way. Yeah, it gives me an extra chance in case I roll bad damage dice on my next charge. Lol. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna... Is, is there even really possible for me to win? I don't think it is, but we can just play it out. <laughs> um, so w do you literally just have the Predator and the Chaplain left? Yeah. No, I literally not. don't think it's fine. Even if I wiped whole squads this turn, I don't think I could have won. Be because I am so far ahead on primaries, it's not going to matter. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. Uh... So, uh, fist bump through the computer screen. <laughs> oh, all right, to the death. All right, to the now death. Just, so now, chat, now it just turns into a bloodbath. <laughs> Let's do it. Well, why not? All right, here's our charges then. Um... To be fair, if your predator would have actually done any sort of work for you, this would have gone far differently. Yeah, this guy would probably name. be dead and have like oh, yeah. 
way like, less more terminators up. Would have done anything. Yeah, I would have a qu and, couple more terminators to be able to. And my melee dreads are what just dumpstered your army. Yeah, they were actually incredible. And then your Arjack is just like a guided missile. Just came up, <laughs> killed my leader, and died. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I was kind of hoping you wouldn't kill him because I wanted to use the Space Wolf CP deed worthy of a saga, which lets me give one of my non-Warlord characters their saga. And you want to know what his saga is? Mm. Every single unit within six inches gets a six up feel no pain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh but my god. All right, so. All right, uh, charges. This guy gets in automatically. Use yeah. This, Are you charging this, me? Yeah, yeah. Right we'll, we'll we'll come in with the predator. Why not? Wait. Oh on. my can god. I, can, did you fail? Yes. Can I fire Overwatch anyway? Uh, not after my chaplain comes in. You can oh, fire okay. it out the chaplain. Oh fuck it. Let's do it. All right. Spend a CP. Cause that Hellfrost cannon is fucking scary. It is. It really is. Um, we'll make this focused, cause it's funnier that way. Oh, it only hits on sixes anyway. Oh well. Okay. Uh, I it get the first like, fight. It would have been hilarious had that hit. <laughs> Just whack. Uh. All right. Five attacks. Hitting on twos. Oh, very good. Hitting on threes. We just start spending my last my CPs. Yeah, sure, why not? Might as well. Four hits. And uh, all right, that's four for you. Cause it's a uh, AP minus. I forget, cause it's tap. It's cause it's assault. It's AP minus four. Oh, so is it AP minus four? Yeah, it is. I forgot. Then I keep I forgetting tactical tactics. Okay. So assign your damage. So you've got the so you've got the plus one to damage, right? Uh, I do. And, and then it's D three, so it's three, duty, four, five, six. I've got duty on ending, so it's that's minus one, so it's just straight D threes. Yep. So we got six. All right, I get to make six six up. Feel no pains now, boys. Yeah, I keep thinking about that tactical doc or assault doctrine. Oh, it's not enough. Do you have a CP you want to spend it on them? No, because I'd still take four of them and I'm only at four. Oh yeah, you're right. Um, actually, hold on. Um... Cause isn't there a... Hold on, there's some bullshit in the Codex Space Marines, hold on. Wait, isn't there an automatic explode or something? No, that's a Mechanicus thing. I know they have it. It's like Vengeance of the Machine Spirit. And they can choose to automatically explode. I was basically looking for something that would let me uh, fight before he dies, but I'm not seeing it, so fuck it. All right, so, uh, explosion time? Explosions? Yep. Yeah. Oh man, if you roll that six, I'll be so mad. And I can't re-roll this. No. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted to dumpster him so badly. I'm too fair, this guy is like probably gonna be taken down by vultures now. <laughs> You're not wrong. All right, well. Uh, that's the end of it. Yeah, he's gonna move right here. Yeah, that's the end of my turn. We're just, I guess, gonna skip the points, I guess. Yeah, you have one. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll just see what happens at the end of turn five. So, hold on, so I've got, okay, so I get, oh yeah. All right. All right. Uh, I'm at four of ten. Let's make my move characteristic. Six inches. Okay. Alright, 
Um, let's... Oh, no, no, no. I want my measurement tool. Thank you. This poor chap... This chaplain has actually been quite a beast. Okay, so that dot is technically outside of engagement range. Okay. But I cannot fail the charge now. All right. Um, is this the bit where we just pile in and say, fuck it? Yeah, basically. Because <laughs> I think it is. So at the end of my turn, I don't score anything. Yeah. Come on, boys. In your turn, you score three objectives? Uh, I already just... scored three, yeah. So, so you it's get 15. 15? Yeah. So you got from 29 to. A bunch. Was that 44? Yep. Am I within uh, 12 inches to use that heavy flamer? Lol. <laughs> All right, so shooting time. So let's start with the fun stuff. Uh, I'm using it. Uh, whatever you do, I'm gonna use pain as a lesson, which gives me a six up. Feel no pain. Until I'm right, around. So, er. Okay, so we're gonna stick the heavy flamer at you. Oh, and a face. Then... Okay, if you're gonna attack on maybe then I'll listen to you. All right, anyway. Mm -hmm. All right, what are your attacks? Uh, so we're going to chuck the Heavy Flamer at the Chaplain and the Focused Hellfrost at the Predator. So we'll do the Heavy Flamer first. That's a D6 attacks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm, five using attacks. That hmm? I'm using that strategy for six of feel no pain. For the rest of the phase or for the rest of the round? Phase. Okay. Ooh, okay, yeah, that's uh, three wounds. Or four wounds. Yeah, that's four wounds. Okay, uh, AP minus one. Three ups. I'm good. All right. Um, then I get to send my Hellfrost cannon focused at your predator. I want this thing <laughs> dead. I want his whole family dead. How the world you forget he ever existed in the first place. That is. That That's a good hit. Yeah, with that, uh. Oh, yeah. And we got. Versus seven, so you got a three to wound. Alright. Yeah, that wounds. Uh, AP minus four? Uh, three, six. That goes through. And that is, uh, D, oh boy, D6. Ooh, okay. All right, hold, hold, hold the fuck out. Oh. This way, it can't get any worse. So, I'm down to five wounds on that predator. Okay, hold on. Which brackets me and a bit. Because it's a Hellfrost focused, if a model suffers any unsaved wounds but is not slain, roll a d6. On a six, the target suffers a mortal. Oh. Nope, no mortal. Okay. Um. It does down my ballistic skill to four up. Razorback. Everything into the predator. Okay. So I get my what? Uh, storm bolter, two shots, and heavy twin linked bolter. That's six shots. Okay. Oh fuck. Ugh. Ballistic skill on this fucker. Uh, three's hit. Well, unless it's bracketed. It's bracket. Oh, it's four up now. Oof. I mean, hey, at least it's the good weapon. <laughs> oh, I don't uh, think that's five, no. All right. 
Um, sure. We'll send ten bolters at the Predator, why not? I just want this thing My dead. My goose is getting cooked. Three ups. God damn it. Are you? You're gonna need, uh, strength four is seven, you're gonna need fives. Ooh. Three of them. Uh, saves. All right, and then from the blood claws, can there's anything in range? Two of them are in range. I got oh, two heck pistols. yeah. Are you, you're I not even the, oh, trying to aim for my chaplain, huh? No, fuck that. Two hits. Both hits. I don't think Bjorn lets me reroll wounds, unfortunately. Uh, no, he just lets me reroll hits. Damn it. Oh, All right. Okay. What do I need? A lot? That's not going to do it. Not enough. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Sorry. All right. This is where it gets hairy. So I can't fail that charge. I'm out of command points. I can't do much here. <laughs> uh, uh, sneeze. Bonk. Swing boys, right? Is there any chance I want to use it? Is he this? Not really. He's upright, I just can't. This tear is just better every way. Alright. Good for damage. He's there, I just can't get him to stay. Okay. Sure. And then these guys. <sighs> I also technically can't fail this charge. But I just don't get to pack in quite as tight as I'd maybe like. So I essentially pack in like that. Okay. God yeah, yeah, it. I no. got you. Yeah, stand on top of that burning barrel. Son of a bitch. I said stay. Okay, whatever. Uh, fuck it, I'm gonna try for that nine inch charge with Bjorn. Fuck it. If my guy can make it out, I'll be impressed. Through the uprights, baby. There you go. Through the uprights. Oh We're my god, you barely made it. Holy crap. We're coming in hot, baby. We're coming in hot. Okay, I'm in there. I just can't get the model to stay. Yeah. So I'm going to park out here, but Bjorn's in there. Uh, my chaplain's gonna shit his pants, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Bjorn's gonna fight first, because fuck you, that's why. Mm -hmm. uh, this is gonna be insane, because uh, I have Savage Fury. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be good. Okay. This is good. Um, actually, you know what? Um, One additional hit on sixes. Oh, baby. Uh, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna kick, go for the throat as a space wolf stratagem. <laughs> so I get Assault Doctrine again. So I have two instances of it. Oh, okay. wait, so you get yeah. like even better AP. Um, well, n well, so, uh, yes, improves the armor character pen, uh, yes. And on a modified six improves the armor pen by one. Oh my God. So, um, you're, That'd be disgusting. And then, so we're gonna take True Claw, which is five attacks, uh, mm -hmm. six because I charged. Mm -hmm. Cause yay space wolves. Hitting on twos. Um, probably wounding on those, except for the one. So it's strength plus five, so strength twelve. Yeah, everything but the one. Uh, I'm gonna spend a CP and reroll that. Okay, there you go. That's a good measure. Um, and just in case. So, um, that all of that wounds. Of so that's what? One, two, three, four. So that's six AP minus four? Um, yeah, I failed three of them. <laughs> uh, just clobbered. Uh, and then, so you said you failed three of them? Yep. So then it's technically D6 damage a piece? I just want to see if we can get the mythical 18 damage. We cannot, but that's still a lot. 
no. Oh god, I drank your guys too. That's fine. I care. I don't care. It's irrelevant at this point. All right. Beautiful. Ah, uh, um, that was a pipe pace. Wait, now I get to consolidate? Oh yeah. Wait, do you have enough to hit my? Yeah, I do, because I'm gonna spend one for relentless assault. Bjorn's gonna consolidate all the way in. Oh and just my my last, God, that's my so last disgusting. My last command point, and Bjorn's gonna consolidate all the way into your. Is that me? My guy gets a chance to attack. <laughs> <laughs> the consolidation? Or no, it, it probably doesn't because it's at the very end of the fight phase. Yeah. Okay. Um. Fight's over. Morale. Uh, I do not. Actually, wait. No, I probably don't score engage on all fronts. Uh... And I do not score warrior pride. Well, actually, yes, I do. Because yeah, uh, two or more units charged. So I score three. Got it. All right, your turn, buddy. Okay. Well, I have one whole thing. I can't move. I can shoot, actually. This How have vehicles. I not damaged this predator at all? I'm on minus one, so I need fives to hit. I mean, you have. Oh. It's at five hits. A five left. Oh, durr. Yeah, you help frosted it. So it's bracketed. I need a five to hit you in melee. Um, I probably don't have anything better to spend it on for vehicles in melee. So, all right, doesn't do anything. All right, one wound. Uh, so right. minus three. Three minus three. Uh, so I'm a six up. I fail that. Six up. Feel no pain. Or five up, feel no pain, forgive me. Nah, uh, you don't get the feel no pain yet. I need to roll damage. Oh, oh I got six. So, si wait, six I, I have a chance if I Stormbolt through you to death after this. Wait, so that was six damage? Six damage. So that gets reduced down to five. Then I need to make five... Six, oh, five ups. Oh! Jesus Christ, okay. Sure, then, Bjorn, sure. Okay, I'm down to five. <laughs> and the storm bolts are... I guess there is still theoretically a chance. Ooh. Wait, no, they only do one damage. And they don't wound. Okay. Okay, well... Charge phase? Fight phase. I oh, only you hit first. <laughs> Okay, so I get what? What is it? Five attacks? I don't get anything there, and it's gonna be one. So I don't get anything there. And you got hold one, hold more. You get fifteen. So I've got five attacks, rerolling wounds. Uh, so four hits. Jesus. Um. Somewhat strength twelve. Yeah. So you wound on, uh, threes. So I get to reroll my twos because Bjorn and True Claw. And the ones? So three hits. You get to roll ones and twos? Um, so True Claw just lets me. Um, so each time an attack is made, you can reroll the wound roll. Okay, for nice. True Claw. Yeah. yeah. All right, so, so that's three. So three wounds. Or... With d6 damage. Yep, 18 uh, minus four. Which means it goes through. I'll just through. Also oh, assault Jesus. doctrine. And double assault doctrine. Oh, wait, that was last turn. Well, sorry, one of those ones doesn't count. 10 damage. Does it explode? Explode, 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 explode. Oh, oh all right. Oh, well, that's... You know how badly I wanted that to work. <laughs> well, that's I a GG. The final battle, Bjorn claws it apart and just it explodes in his face. Oh my god, that'd be amazing. Well, a virtual handshake to you. Uh, GG for that game. GG, WP, thank you for joining me for this adventure. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. god damn. If yeah. that predator would have done any kind of work for you, yeah. that would have gone so differently. Yeah, definitely. The four last cannons, and they just couldn't make it. I mean, they had like two whole rounds of shooting on that dread that started over here, that venerable dread, and just couldn't really chip it at all. Like, this whole battle would have played out so differently 
if that would have worked because I never would have got either of my dreads into your Terminator line. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to be real honest, you would have won then. Because what would have happened is we literally would have swung around and I would have been fighting from your deployment zone and you would have been fighting from my deployment zone, but you would have had a position of strength because you would have had that predator in the back corner to take everything out. Yeah, well, also what worked really well for you, that Razorback leading this intercessor squad that was over here. Yeah. Like, that was big, too. So, for for those who care about some of the more competitive versions, uh, Razorback Rush with Blood Claws, or in my case, Wolf Guards, if you're using them on the charge, they're irrelevant. Actually, Blood Claws are better if you're mm -hmm. going to do that. Just a Razorback Rush with Blood Claws is terrifying. <laughs> So oh, good. Because so good. As, everybody, as everybody's seen, you just roll in, pile out, spray everything with heavy bolter fire, and then charge in and just wreck shit. Yeah. So much damage well, potential. And well, your and characters think, are disgusting too, and your dreads did amazing. They're hard to crack. I, I think I think too, one of the one thing that didn't help, or one thing that worked in my favor is because you had everything over in um, kind of that corner where you put your Predator. Mm -hmm. um, and there wasn't really anything on that side I cracked through. So, assu like, assuming you could have held it, the fight would have gone differently. But the fact that I cracked that in a single round just kind of collapsed the battlefield in on you. Yeah, yeah, it really did. I didn't expect my intercessors to go, to go down so fast and so easily. I don't think any of us did either, if we're being real honest here. <laughs> like, because I did not expect to roll in with a Razorback and five Grey Hunters and wipe out an eight-man squad of Intercessors, or seven, however big your Intercessor squad yeah. was. Yeah, yeah. Was I like did not bad. expect to wipe out an Intercessor squad in a single round like that. I expected that to be a two-round engagement over that one control point, mm -hmm. or that one objective. Not a one-round engagement and then start flanking around. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say one thing that didn't work for me is I didn't have enough bolters. <laughs> I probably should have had more troops and all, over all that because, yeah, the bolters work really well with Imperial Fist, and I think, you know, having maybe a bigger focus on that could be better. But that being said, I guess, you know, bolters and something to take down those guys. Well, and that, I don't know, for whatever reason, you said you were going to run um, Imperial Fists, and I was just like, Oh, they're going to be heavy armor things. What can I get that's got armor? What, like, literally, what can I get that's anti armor? And I was like, melee dreads? <laughs> <laughs> because, of course, everybody's first thought when I have to kill vehicles is melee. <laughs> hey, big that's axes. Real <clears throat> big axes. <clears throat> like, goddamn. Ah, oh, I love it. Oh, thank you so much. GG to you. Uh, this is wonderful. We'll have to do this again for sure. We'll thank like up to like 1500 or something or 2000 if you want to do that. Thank you for playing my dude. <clears throat> thank you for helping me learn this wonderful game. Um, mm -hmm. It definitely got smoother as you we went through. I will send you pictures of uh, the physical uh, Space Wolves as they get finished because that's always fun. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, Those are lovely. But uh, thank you for playing. And yes, we should definitely do this again sometime. <laughs> All right, GG.